How come you're not in my class, Carl? I don't know. How do I put you in the classroom? Oh, there you go. What is this weird view you've got going on here? <laughs> Can you see it the way I am? Do you see me in the middle and you at the top? Yes. <laughs> Let's see how that works. Did okay. you have any problem whatsoever getting in? Because I've had problems with Zoom this week where I, I've changed some settings. Nope, nope. And I was having problems getting in. People couldn't get in without a password. And I was like, what? Uh, so I just was playing with the settings right now. I will say because of this view, I can't choose a custom background though. Ooh, because it's just you. It's not your background. You're right. over so far to this. Oh, here I can. No, choose, I can't. choose virtual background. It's completely grayed out. Oh, that's funny. Let's see what else we have here. Change immersion, view, immersion views. Okay, so if we just want to have a panel discussion or fireplace chat here's just <laughs> but I'm, I'm looking away from you <laughs> I know. Like so. and you're like a little tiny thing <laughs> you're like so funny <laughs> what else we got well, this one only allows two people so um, there are some that allow 25. That's one of those rooms. <laughs> you haven't seen these before, huh? Mm -mm. Okay, here's another one. <laughs> this can get 24 people. And what's this? Richard Saunders is playing with these. <laughs> We're on the ski slopes. <laughs> you ready to go skiing, Carl? Nope. Whoosh. <laughs> oh my God. <coughs> okay. This one can I think have eight people. Oh, this is a good one. Now, can you select which room you which one you're in? Uh, I don't think so. I wonder if I can move you around. It makes it look. Oh, I can move your. Oh, it allows me to make your. Hmm. This this cobweb running right across my nose. It did you. <laughs> Itching you, yeah. but see, it's allowing me to shrink your screen. Now, I don't know why it's allowing me to shrink it, but then it bounces right back as soon as I let up. I wonder if I can move myself. Oh, I can. So, I guess I can move you to one of these more narrow ones. Let me see. I can move you to one. Well, it's just the corner of your nose there. Practically one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Well, let's see who else shows up because this is kind of cute. I like this one. It is Halloween after all. I don't think you have near enough windows though for the number of people that are going to show up. Yeah, well, we'll just let the first few show and then I'll change it. Let's see what happens. Let's just be doing something different today. Y'all ready for trick or treaters? You trick or treating? I never do trick or treaters. Oh, well, fine. <clears throat> Here comes Kyle and Leonard. Leonard's seen these, I think, before. Let's and Yoshi. Oh, look, he's brought, he's brought the bird. Yoshi. Yoshi? Kyle's flipping us the bird. <laughs> <laughs> now he's showing us the empty hand. Oh, she must be a vampire bird. Look, her yeah. reflection doesn't show up. Oh, well, you're, she's too far to the side, I think. No, she's literally on my hand. Doom is yeah. editing her out. Wow, vampire! She bird. showed up for like a half a second, and then she disappeared. And oh, you can no. see her. Oh. You can see there her left feet. You can see your feet on your hand. That's costume, it. Huh? Let me move myself move over. Bird. So I can move you guys, but I can't move. You can't move you, right? I can't move me. No. I, I think I, Carl should be down one of these small. No, no, but your face is so small. Yoshi. What do you say to a bird? 
Oh, she Yo. can't hear you guys. Oh. I don't know what you would say to a bird. I could tap on the screen, but that's not going to do it Say to a bird what you would say to any animal. Yo, bird. We could allow a couple more people, and then I'll have to go back to the different... Or, more specifically, any non-human animal. <clears throat> They're showing up on top. Yeah, so let's see. You have I to assign I... them to a frame. Yeah, I have to drag them in. There's James. Hi, James. All right. I was, I was going to feel left out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm waiting for the video to come up on these other. It takes a second to drag you over. Let's see. Hi, Brian. You're rapidly going to run out of frames. Uh, <clears throat> Bob's coming in. Where's nearly headless Nick? <laughs> what? Where did you? <laughs> look at look at Kyle, you guys. Can you see what Kyle's holding? <laughs> Ooh, magic beautiful. bird. Why is everybody in black? We're not. I'm not. I'm, not. I'm in dark blue. Know. Your backgrounds are all black, it looks like. Oh, it's because of the hollow, the backgrounds we have right here. The I think for the... How come Brian's background is showing? Yeah, but his is it. He's special. He's in the upper left-hand corner. That's why. He gets the real background. See, huh? doesn't this feel like we're in Harry Potter? And the pictures that move? Yeah, oh, Brian, why are your background showing? And you know what? Look at um, James' background here. showing. It's not my background. It's my living. Well, I don't know what the room this is, but whatever. It is. <laughs> Bob what is dressed as a pirate, I think. Oh, he really is. He's moving. Oh, my gosh. That was the background. <laughs> what? Oh, that's funny. Bob is dressed up. I thought it was a very still picture of him. No, I... I've got, I have four Zooms this week. Uh, this is the second one. I was going to do them all in costume for Halloween. I, oh, I did this costume. I finished it two years ago and I never got to use it because uh, thank, uh, Halloween was snowed out two years ago. And then last week it was COVID. So oh. this is the first chance I've had to wear it. Okay, here's one more person. I have one square left, and then I have to change this over. Oh, I see. That's a good one. Where did you get this? It's on Zoom. Oh, is it? Yeah, there's a whole bunch of them. I love that. We have one square for you. <clears throat> Let me drag you into it. Okay. Cool. Oh, I did get rid of his virtual background. That's that. <laughs> oh man, I wanted to be double spooky. Double spooky. Double spooky. I'll have to try. I'm gonna have to try another one. So I'm gonna put you guys in a different one just because we can. Let's take. A picture take... Of this. Take a oh picture yeah. Of this. Okay, hold on. <clears throat> Okay, everybody look at the camera so that you can oh, look. Don't hide I'm behind the bird. Tiny. Okay, ready? I'm too tiny, so I can't. Okay, smile. Wait, wait. Okay, I think I got it. Let me see. So I'm still confused. Why is there black everywhere? I don't know. Where's black? <clears throat> no, I, I, back. I see very little black. Yeah. What's crazy is um, Brian sees black, and he's the only one that has a real background behind him. And he's wearing black. Yeah. Your eyes are closed. Thank you. Okay, so I just wanted to save that before I let Romero in. <clears throat> oh, I see. What? Bob is a circle in black. Okay, let's try something that has a little bit more room. Uh, oh. Classroom. Yeah, there's a classroom with 25 seats. I wonder what this will do. <laughs> All, right. <laughs> All right, students. So we're going to talk about Wikipedia today. 
trying to pick on. That is interesting. What's a Wikipedia, Susan? How come some of you are square? Oh, James and <clears throat> Brian are I'm having just... their full screen showing because you've got the virtual backgrounds on. Ah, no, yeah. But you have a virtual background no. on, Ben. I do. But why is it not showing that way? I figured out how to turn a, turn a virtual background on. So technically, I have one. It's just not showing. Yeah. I think whenever you're using this effect, it, it's using our green screen virtualness to put it into your background instead of whichever one we had picked. If I well, stop James the video, isn't I and, and the virtual background. But it I'm seeing my, my, like it should be appearing here. James is a virtual background. I don't see a virtual background. I see the, the classroom. Yeah, I see the classroom. Oh, behind moment. you, I see the galaxy or whatever that is. Mine says, you cannot oh, see I a classical know. background mm -hmm. while you are in an immersive view. Right. Well, like oh, lecture. really interesting. Huh. All right, I don't even see. I don't even see him. Where is he? Where's who? And how come, how come Bob is circle? It was a circle in the first one. It must have stuck. Oh, I know my camera's off. Oh, you're. I wish no, we, we, we I see. I don't see James at all. Yeah. I just see a still image for James. Oh, it's Romero and Faith. Oh, Romero's here, but Faith can't be here. Oh, there she is. Oh, I'm glad you're feeling better, Faith. Uh, and I'm not feeling better. Oh, just, my DNA is yes. being altered. I was fine for 24 hours, and now Pfizer's kicked in. Well, it's re it's oh, rendering you partially invisible. So where is Faith? Right here. Oh, okay. Wait, James, where are you? He's having some trouble maintaining oh, there you are. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here. It I doesn't see. have your names. It should have your names underneath these little areas. A couple names have popped up. Really? Yeah. Uh, In the previous uh, setting. No, I, I saw one name here. I just see black. <laughs> you still I don't know why you see black. I see all of you with a black background. I'll take so a, the I the last your time client that can't render the virtual backgrounds, right? What is it? Your, your client is not capable of rendering the virtual backgrounds, so it's just showing black instead of rendering a, the chair behind me. But it always used to. Okay, look at I, me. I'm gonna take a picture. Well, this this needs more. Who is uh, compute power? Yeah, this is this is Susan's magic voodoo screen. Wait, is that Kyle? Whose picture is it? Who's sort of there and sort of not there? <laughs> I think that's Kyle. Wait, so this is coming from the source from it's Susan? coming from my zoom. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna take a picture so you guys can see what this looks like. Okay. okay. I don't know okay. if this is if this is being wait, where done am I? on I don't see myself. Oh <laughs> I don't know if it's just wait, wait. I don't know Faith if this is being out. done on Susan's computer or by a uh, a Zoom server. All right, well Okay, I ready? Don't... Do you One, see me? Two, Susan? I don't three. We see a stationary you. Okay. Huh. My, my camera's my on. on. Not, oh, there I am. All right. Are you going to revert back to normal view now? Yeah, I think so. I just want to take a save this photo real quick. Classroom. There's Kyle. Oh, now he shows up. Without a bird. Okay. Oh, there's the bird. All right, let me Here, I'm going to, oh, I have to get out of this so I can share the screen so I can show you what those two pictures look like. I need to get out of this. My video? No. Um, upper right view. And select gallery. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah. So this is what I was able to see. I'll show you because. Now I see everything. Yeah, well. I got rid of it, but here's what it looked like. Oh. See, nobody's black, except James has his square. And for some reason or other, Bob is a circle. And you still have your full screen on. I don't know why that is. And then here's- So I, I was on blur. <laughs> so I wonder if that, uh, you know, a blurred background. You here's look a little blurry, but your background I mean, in, in the picture I just shared, you, you right. have a little bit of a blur on you. Yeah, I think that's just because my camera's dirty. Here, do you want to see what I saw? Yeah. You took a picture? I did. Oh, that's nice. Like for me. <laughs> but 
that didn't have anything to do with the ho- the screen we yeah, had. Yeah, it, it just wasn't able to uh, render yeah, it. It's your, it's your computer. Okay, so... Uh, your computer is an old client. Well, I'm using an old... Well, it's not old, but I haven't... I'm still using Yosemite on this particular one. What it's the heck computer. is Yosemite? It's a version of the Mac OS. Mac OS. Oh, well, there yeah. you go. Here's, here's yeah. what the Halloween one looked like. Well, you look clearer now, Leonard. Yeah, I cleaned my... Uh, See the camera. Halloween? Yeah, that one's cool. I frowned. It only. You know, how come only James got his eight. background, but I didn't get my background? Who knows? Oh, I want my Oogie Boogie in there. Now look, there's. That's like a software feature that's not Yoshi? Ready for prime time. Yoshi. It's Yoshi, yeah. Yoshi. Oh. Hello, Yoshi. You need to put one of the earbuds uh, up to Yoshi so you can hear. <laughs> Earbuds and birds, especially parrots, have a bad history. There's a lot of these yes. cracked in half. Mm-hmm. I can imagine. So why does the screen look different? I mean, I'm playing with my settings today, but this looks different. Different than what? Normal. Looks yeah, your background me. has a different texture. Well, no, it's a different background. Mm. But I'm seeing the screen looks different. Hi, Jeff. Looks the same to me. So, Really? What has Carl got there? Is he doing a category tonight? Yes. I I'll, I just want to know what Carl did to scare those three ladies. That's, they look like that's they're mock on. scared. They don't look really scared. No. So I had a question, but I forgot what it was. <laughs> I think they're day traders. It must have been very important. Have been? Oogie boogie. Sure. Ben isn't I did, I did just te- check the Thomas Westbrook video, and that's still da- not available. Oddly. Yeah, we're we're waiting on it. I just um just gave Jay the the uh, videos for because of the Hi, Sunday screen. Oh, that's good because the Sunday Sunday paper one. Yeah, we've held them back. I recorded something today to introduce the video and just introduce them, and that's it. So that's coming out soon. Is my well, I'm surprised because when I did when I had to appeal my thing with Brian Deere, it was like 24 hours later it was back up. Oh, whenever he, did did Brian Deere's video got taken down? Yeah, because we talked about his book, The Doctor Who Fooled the World, and it was all about Andrew Wakefield and fraud and stuff. And oh, that's right. We mentioned anti-vac or whatever we talked about. Of course, it got flagged, and so they're I, overreacting. This is just I blame. Then, I, they, they are not reacting. It's just yeah. shitty software. Right. Well, that's what I mean. Kyle should get in there and clean Well, he out. also claimed that he thinks people on the inside don't like him because everything he does gets taken down. Oh, says. Wakefield? No, I was talking about just No, no not Wakefield. Hockey. Brian Deere. Brian Deere. I, I'm saying that the YouTube and Facebook are just... Well, yeah. Their algorithms do not discern between people criticizing bullshit and people <laughs> promoting bullshit. Right. Hey, that's funny. Hi, Alan. My name is Of Romero. It's not fake. This is me. What is it? Of Romero. Of Romero. Of Romero. Oh, he's a handmade. I think you're supposed to say red, isn't it? Isn't it something red? Yes. No, I mean, isn't the name supposed to be? No, it's of whoever your your the the master is of your house. Off of red. Yeah, of off red is a Fred uh, Waterford. Oh, so the person's name is Red. Okay, that's why they get the red. I Fred. haven't seen it. So of Fred. Oh, of Fred? Fred? I thought it was Red. No, oh, Fred. of Fred, like yeah. of Mark. But it sounds <laughs> like that is her name, is of Fred. Wow. I thought it was of, of Red. Fred, yeah. Like I there's... Looked it off Fred. <laughs> mm-hmm. I've been out of it a little bit, so I've never, really, I've never seen it, but I've, I know what it is. And they've got that big Scientology woman who's doing the. Yes, we won't talk about that. She was born. Susan? Hmm? Susan, I got, I got props. I'm armed. <laughs> the chickens are running for me right now. Oh, Ooh, nice. Oh, there you go. You got to hold it like this when you drink it. Of amber liquid. What's What's funny is when Bob looks great. was in the circle window and smaller, I uh, thought he had a filter on. I didn't realize he was actually dressed up. The pirate filter? <laughs> yeah, who's, who's, I thought he was using a pirate filter. Who's dressed up? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> well, when Bob kind of came on he was very still like this well i was and i thought he was a pitcher of bob i can, I can do dressed that. up as a pirate 
have is we're off red of of Romero. Now, so what happens if you if, if Romero has more more than one? He can't. He has one handmaid at a time. Is that right? They, yeah. Have you not read the book? None. You totally should read it. No. It's yeah. very violent. So if only Kyle could give Yoshi to have for Bob to have on his shoulder. Mm -hmm. I think Yoshi should sit on his head. Right. <laughs> Maybe you could just find a chicken and put it on your shoulder. With uh, <laughs> with with sufficient photoshopping skills, this could be done. Oh, look, Adrian's come in now. Everybody be nice to Adrian. She got a really bad headache. Oh, she's got a bad headache. So be quiet. Don't don't set her off. Be nice. So I uh, I fell down and broke my face today. What? What? <laughs> keep your keep your voices modulated. I don't yeah. want anybody to startle yeah, if, or to harm you, Adrian uh, now. So very if nice. you oh. um, pin me, pin you or or um, spotlight me. Uh oh, I think you'll be able to see a pretty fun black eye. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. I can see it. It's yeah. Yeah, where? Yeah, that. Oh. oh. So what did Priva do this time? <laughs> I, I was going to say Leonard got into a fight with an anti-vaxxer. <laughs> no, I got into a fight with a sidewalk. Oh, that's brutal. Oh, man, that's a fight I've been on. The sidewalk probably had it coming. Don't win the, that the, one. The, 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 si the sidewalk one. Yeah, I was, uh, I was walking, and I was walking through what Get I it. thought was just a pile of leaves, and there was a big pine cone. Uh -huh. <gasps> hidden, oh, no. and I landed, you know, stuck my foot on it and completely lost my footing. Brutal. Yeah, well, that's why they call it fall, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that was, oh, yeah, that well, was really whatever, bad. Whatever the reason they call it fall, <laughs> that's what I did. I just waited a couple months. Remember back last October when you, and it would have been really funny. Yeah. So, anyway, you can unpin me now, Susan. You are unpinned. <laughs> Am I? Yeah. Oh, uh, it, it automatically goes into the the. Um, you have to put it back into gallery view, probably. Or oh, everybody has to do it. Huh? Yeah. yeah. I know. I know what I was going to ask now. Oh. Oh, okay. Miss Brian. Ask me for. Thank you. I have the floor or the screen. So on Sunday, I think it was at the um, a skeptical, right? And Eugenie kept asking people to mute or mute their screens and stuff. I saw one woman really close up, constantly pouring chocolate syrup into a spoon and eating it. <laughs> now, was that a troll? Because was she trolling or something? I was wondering if that was like... I didn't uh, see her. Who was that? I well, sent you a message, Susan, saying, look so at that, this woman. I don't want to mention the person's name in case it was an accident, but it kept going and going. I thought maybe she was somebody that left the link and was pulling a prank. No, it was happened. she on the small screen or was she pinned? No, no, she was in, it was yeah. in the part of the gallery view while... I saw it too, and I sent Susan a private message to say, look at her, watch what she's doing. I did, I must have missed it. Anything. That's the kind I was of getting lots of messages. People, that's the kind of thing people do before they throw in a porno bomb. They, they have somebody <laughs> doing something innocuous like that to make sure they have access, and then the next thing you know, the whole thing is hacked. Well, yeah, she had a so spoon. expert at this, Brian. I, kept pouring, I, thought she was eating, I thought she had a hot fudge sundae or something, but it turned out. It was Hershey's spoon. syrup and a spoon, and she just and kept, then she, she must have ate six and of she them. She did this for like a half hour. No way. <laughs> and then when it was out, she was like, No way. Okay. You say so that I think it's a bad thing. thing. Tell me. Who I'm just was. saying it's an odd thing to see it like this for half an hour. It's like nobody wants to see that. So. I noticed that too. I don't remember who she was. It wasn't. Someone. I remember the name, but I wasn't going to say anything because I don't. I don't okay, want to. Text text well, actually, if she knows, she knows who she is. If text me the name, I wonder who it is. All right. Because you can just know. you can put it just privately <laughs> to Susan in the chat. You can go back and watch, uh, Susan, and I sent you a message when it was happening. Wasn't well, which, it Paul Offit? Which video was she on? Paul Offit. It was Paul. It was maybe the one later. Well, maybe wait, we can't see the gallery. Paper. Can we see the gallery? You can't see the gallery. Oh yeah, the you video? can set it so you have the. So you have. I had not gallery. I'm sorry. I had the bar. So it was on the bar. Oh, I don't know who that is. Exactly. So now that you've told me, I don't know who she is. So I didn't know you guys were critiquing people's eating habits. I was gonna eat my watermelon here, but I'm not gonna do that now. Because <laughs> Brian like. Know. No, he was talking <laughs> about her eating like crazy. No, it was just odd because it was. 
spoon after spoon after spoon of Hershey's syrup. That's it. Okay, you say Kevin, that I'm like it's a you, bad thing. I'm saying. Oh, no, I guess name. it's okay, but I have diabetes. I wouldn't do it. I, it's, not, it's fine if she wants it's to do elevator. that. It's a little odd to do it as close as Rob is right now. <laughs> yeah, that's how it looks. <laughs> that is what it looked like. Hey, Kevin, I'm sending you her name. See if that seems familiar to you. Because that's what I think it was. Yeah, I think so. Okay. I think so. I've never heard of her. And I, I think, think you it was do. like somebody that got the link and just... Was... I thought her name was Susan Gerbic or something. Oh, look, like Peggy. Oh, that's scary. Hey. Hi, Peggy. I, was, I noticed hat. Susan wore about a dozen <laughs> different hats. Though. She wore about a dozen different hats. I yeah, but I've only pulled this one like out. That. I've got I've got this one. This one's kind of fun, but you can't really tell what it is. Can you tell what that is? Oh, Squid. A hat. An octopus. Is that a spider? Spider. No. It's, it's a flying spaghetti monster. So Leonard, you didn't oh. see this woman. You didn't see it, it happening. I uh there's the eyeball, see? I was okay. mostly looking at the YouTube uh, videos because the oh. Zoom ones were so horrible. Yeah, me too. I, think I had to go to Zoom for some reason. Something wasn't working for one of the talks. StreamYard, StreamYard is the name of the main app they were using. I do it. Yes, I had not heard of that before. Hmm. Yeah, and for some reason, StreamYard uh, does not recognize the. Camera oh, look on at my the desktop. Queen is here. Queen, Queen Jane. <laughs> nice look, Jane. It's Halloween. What can I say? <laughs> Here's Mike, celebrity locator. What the heck? It's a piece of artwork from when I used to work at a celebrity gossip magazine. Oh, you did? Ooh, so you know all the celebs. Hello, Queen Jane. I know some of the people that know some of the celebs. <laughs> I thought maybe that was your Halloween costume as you were going to be like a, it had like a little box around you and it said celebrity locator. <laughs> and then your picture would be in it. Oh, 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 oh right. Little red riding like hood. Stalker. Oh, I, I saw, I, I obviously missed, no. missed the trick. This is just a costume. Yeah. Under what? his eye, Kevin. This is just a costume. <laughs> Lord open. Yeah. Oh, oh, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I it wasn't a clot. So yeah, yeah. yeah, you yeah. know what I had to on spotlight. I just removed the spotlight. That's interesting. I didn't realize yeah. I'd done that. Interesting. Okay, we're getting there. I'm gonna try this room again one more time since we got so many people here. I want to see what it looks like. No, we didn't. Uh, let's try this one. <laughs> Everybody but Brian Kirby can probably see that. <laughs> Alan does that too. See, the, Alan did the circle just like Bob's does. That's weird. Uh, James and Wilma oh. look normal to me still, except they Wilma. Look what the normal. heck? Wilma <laughs> turned into did, a ghost. Did, like did the you say oh, like ghost? Wow. Yeah. She's got no She's eyes. Us in and out. Is that coffee or wine? That or looks coffee? very uncomfortable, Wilma. What? <laughs> it's coffee. Well, double espresso. Yeah. I have Leonard and I have Kyle that I would I'd you pass take a freak uh, out of this, Susan, in case I'd be passing notes to in my class. I still don't have eyes. <laughs> I get it. I don't know if who's beneath me in your picture, but in my picture, I'm biting <laughs> Leonard's head. Bad. <laughs> 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 oh yeah, <laughs> that's cool. Oh, well, does everybody in this mode? Does everyone see it the same way? I don't, I don't know. know. So who's in the upper left? So. Your upper left. Uh, you are right. Uh, <laughs> and who's next to me? Uh, Adrian. Adrian. Oh, Adrian. so far, okay, the same. And then uh, my dad. Uh, Alice, Alice. Okay, yeah. So middle. okay, this so this puts them all the same view for everyone. Interesting. Yeah, Alice is in the middle. And then, uh, yep. 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 Okay. And then Kevin, and then Spooky Wilma. <laughs> yep. <laughs> James is below me, right yep, there, right? James. Yep. Yep. And Kyle. Yep. I'll take I'll Spooky Gerbic for the block. <laughs> and do these I don't, I don't see James. I don't see James either. Oh, here. who's yeah. below me in your view? No yeah, one. Nobody. nobody. So James's camera that is, seems to be image. frozen. But I yeah. see him there. It I is frozen. Image. Image. You see a frozen image. Yes. He's letting. Or he's just not reacting. That is How come interesting. Janine is also um, like a has her real background in it. Yeah, Bobby Janine looks like he's in, in the chair. Captain Kirk's chair. Probably. It's, it's like all I can do. It won't let me do anything more. He doesn't I can't show wear up my little, um, my little uh, technology shaming. Thingy, that little yeah, crowd. 
in this well, mode. Like I'm going to exit it because I want to be able to see all you. I want you to put your little hat on and things too. Bobby, but yeah, it also didn't do a very good job at like doing double faces. Yeah. Here's my costume. Oh, that's Here's my cute. costume from a couple of years ago. I went as Jerry Garcia. Oh, Where are you? <laughs> Oh, nice. What is that? Where are you? I don't know where wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh okay. there. Okay. And then Ben is a Yoda. Maybe Yoda. Yeah. Which yeah. isn't really Yoda. A Grogu. It, it, what's Grogu. funny is because he's green, if I take him away from my face, he disappears because uh. he's green screen. <laughs> he has no head. I like Adrian looks great with that. But it's not the, it's not because he's green. It's basically it does that to anything that's not like right in front of you. I'm, you know, unless I show something right here, it just my hand disappears. My hand is up yeah. on the right now. You can't see it. So are there a bunch of holes? Well, what's weird is uh, the body's fine. It's just the head. That's well, it push push him further away from you, you and it'll yeah. disappear. It's all good. He's trying to detect a face in the picture and focus on that one face. Yeah. So having two faces in the picture, it doesn't know which one to focus on. That's why it was having trouble with me and Julie, despite both of us being in the picture. <laughs> I don't know why it didn't like James, though. There must be someone else in the room. It might be that it's relying on the fish, like whatever video processor is on the on the host computers. Yeah, it relies on your own laptop. So if your laptop's just barely not capable of it or something, yeah, like that's the reason why uh, why Brian's in. Yeah, it's it's unclear where the processing's being done. I can think of three places. You know, no. Some of it's Merrill, being done. The big bad wolf. Some of it's being done in Susan's <laughs> machine. Some oh, of yeah. it could be done on a server. And yeah. Some of it's done on each client. Yeah. Oh, Jamie's joining us. Jamie Camp. Uh, yeah. Louise All the way from, from Thailand. <laughs> yeah, but he doesn't want to talk to us. Oh, he's just starting. He just. So Susan, who's got the categories tonight? Uh, you, Peggy. You have all four, Rob. Peggy, Hello. Kevin, Carl, Rob, and Robin. Hi, Jamie. Hi. Good morning, or good night, whatever you're, whatever. <laughs> He's back, Hi, Jamie. Here. Hi, Jamie. Here's Jack, Hi. Jamie. That's so cool. Mm. You didn't get your second one yet, right? I we got our second vaccine three days ago. Yeah. Fantastic. That happened. Mm. With no side I got, effects. I got my I got my booster shot today. Very good. You do. Nope, I, I got, think yeah, I, huh? I got mine a couple days ago. No reaction. I'm I'm two weeks and no tomorrow will be three weeks for my booster. Oh, oh I good. got mine yesterday. I was told That's why I won. I don't need the booster. No. Right. Yes, you were told by Paul yeah. Offit himself. You Paul told me I do not you need the booster. You are the I winner. Won. He said you Kevin won. is the winner. And here's your dead possum. Come get it. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's do this. You guys don't have a clue. If is that a dead possum trivia? Me? You missed so yes, much. It's a dead possum. So there's a sculpture at the grounds for sculpture, which I went to with my wife, who is a tour guide a few days ago, and she always talks about the dead possum that is part of a sculpture. I didn't steal this. <laughs> this is my very own. No. <laughs> I can come up with my own dead possums. The, the, the rumor, the rumor is it was, it was actually ground up and used to make the sculpture. Oh, Kevin's got his possum on it. And, and the name of it is something like Ode to a Possum. We had, <laughs> we had so much fun on Saturday. Oh my God, you guys. Oh, yeah. That was so much fun. I wish you had, more of you guys had been there. It was a blast. I didn't record it. And I wish I had now. Well, Jay said I could have recorded it if I wanted to, but I said... You know, there's people who've never played before. I don't want to, you know, it wasn't advertised that we were going to, we were going to um, uh, record. But you could have always recorded it and just not. Next. Well, you no, people would have asked. People would have to oh, ask. Oh, yeah. I then, mean, then we would have seen, That's we would have got to see the chocolate lady. Come on, come on. Oh, no, that was, that was oh, before. Yeah. You can still see her. She's somewhere else. Oh, here comes Mono. Mono. <laughs> Mono wasn't playing. Oh, wait, wait, let me say it in a minute. Yeah. No. Mono, Mono's, Mono's ears might have been ringing because I was His cursing him was out felt. because he invented the, wait, uh, the, wait, 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 the mono wait. coins. No, he can't gotcha. hear us. Wait for him. To the mono rules. Out. He's wait there. He gets no, but he's not. His audio is not on. I don't think he can hear us. It, 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 it doesn't hey, have to be on. Are you doing a Thanksgiving episode again? 
I just I'm thought doing it. every Thursday. As far as I know, I'm doing Thanksgiving. That's a long ways away. Pandemic not that long. We're able to fly to wherever we went and do whatever we went. There is Mono. Hello, Mono. Hello, Mono. Mono, Mono. we played by your rules. Mono, did you have hear your ear was burning on Saturday? You're you're famous. You are famous. You know, the rules you saw. Rob was very funny. I hate Mono rules. Then we won. I love Mono rules. (laughs) <laughs> we played trivia on Saturday on on Saturday because of Skeptical. I didn't uh, record it, and um, I came up with I did all the categories myself, and they and and they were skeptic related. And we played a game. I played the bonus was uh, name fellows fellows from CSI that have to be mm-hmm. living, and there's 109 to choose from. But we're using and everybody's like, oh okay, that'll be easy. And then I said. But we're using Mono's rules. <laughs> and everybody went, whoa. <laughs> well, not everybody. Most people didn't know what it was. Well, yeah. the people who knew what it was. People was like, are yeah. kind of going, what? I said I was going to write yeah, a, stro- a strongly predicted- worded letter to Mono to, to Susan <laughs> tell him I don't three, like it. He says, give me your ad- give me Mono's address. Two I'm going to write him a sick. very strongly worded letter. Our How team got sick. Yep. It was so funny. And then they, when their team won, they were like, I love oh, no, we didn't rules. win. We did reason. We did reasonably. It didn't kill us. Yeah, I was two expecting other teams one or two points. But there were several getting six and, and what six was mono? Out. What are mono's rules? Oh, you have to stay. come up. You have to come up with like... unique answers. Oh, okay, yeah, that's boggle cool. Rules. Like it's boggle rules. Uh, yes. What? Mm-hmm. It's boggle. Oh, you say it's cool until you spend. 20 minutes figuring it all out and then no everyone someone else took that someone else took that someone else and you get no points <laughs> then it's not cool yeah but we fun. scored with bill nye the science guy yeah we didn't do bad neil degrasse tyson <laughs> but we lost a point on susan garbick that's right and and only one person is said, susan a fellow I think I so. funny. well i don't know what her pronoun is <laughs> We're fellows, whether we're whatever we gender do. neutral term, just like a, pilot. It is, it is a gender neutral term, just like a or actor now. Actor, <laughs> it was so fun. It, Jay Diamond showed up and he was drinking, and he laughed. He was the whole game, and I I'm shocked he even showed up because he kept telling me, "I'm going to give you controls whenever I show up, and then I'm going to leave." I'm like, okay, because he's, I mean, the guy worked like a dog for, for weeks ahead of time. And he shows up and 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 then I, I don't know what was happening. I guess he had a bottle next to him and he wanted to finish it off or something. And then he laughed through the whole game and he stayed there the whole game to to the to the end, which is a shock. And then he's like, I love you guys <laughs> so much. I love this game. This is great. I mean, it was funny. Wasn't it funny? <laughs> I missed that one. Paula was here. It was funny. It was really funny. We did. Let me tell you what the categories were because this was, it was, I, I enjoyed it a lot. So the first category was, I follow up, by the way. Oh, passed. Hold on a second. We did books by skeptical speakers. So I gave them 13. 12 names of people who have been at Skeptical, except I don't think Randy ever has. And then I gave them 12 book names and they had to match the book names to the author. So that was pretty simple. There's a couple. Randy was at Skeptical once by video. Oh, okay. So that kind of counts. And then then the next category was things I learned from Squaring the Strange podcast. I love that category. It was so funny. You guys were so funny. That um, was hard. I loved it. I thought it was great because I really unless you wa- uh, unless you listen to Squaring the Strange. Yeah, if you listen to Squaring the Strange, <laughs> well, I, people I, said they listened to it, but they were still having trouble with it. I missed that round. How did you present it? Did you put something and say, "Well, is it true or false?" Or what did no, you? No, I said things I learned from Squaring the Strange. So here's yeah. one is um spun. Oh, and and Adrian knows exactly what all the categories are because I gave them to Adrian and she she gave them to her husband and her son and they did it. So she rewarded them. That's why I didn't have you yelling at me so much because they were vetted already. <laughs> Thank you, Adrian. You're welcome. Here's one. Spontaneous human combustion is a pseudoscientific <laughs> concept. In the 1800s, what did popular culture and doctors believe was the cause? Oh, okay. 
So that, that was on screen is strange on yeah. spontaneous human combustion. And then um, the next category was skeptical history, which was one of my favorites. I love that one. Mm -hmm. It was a good one. And then, and then we were all a little weird and we were a little tired. And I know I was tired because I'd been on Zoom forever and for day, a couple of days. And I had a category, good versus evil, evil vaccination edition. I love that one. That was fun. So, <laughs> yeah, so I gave 10 categories one. or people or, or companies. <laughs> and I just gave you the names and I said, are they good or are they evil? And then when we did the answers, <laughs> when we did the answers, we would go, um, like Freedom Angels Foundation, we'd go, Evil! <laughs> People were all going, Evil! <laughs> really getting into it it was really fun. no one's no one's being judgmental about that no. oh, children's, was, children's little, health network <clears throat> yeah and then leonard would say if i gave one and it was good leonard would go so they're evil right because <laughs> he didn't like the answer because it was the opposite of whatever he put is that what is that why that's what leonard kept saying he like if i said hmm. like on wendy sue swanson i said oh she's the uh she's good she's seattle a, a pediatrician she has leonard a, who you no i wasn't there you were there mm -hmm. no you weren't there i wasn't there <laughs> well, who mm. did i that then we had a no, no. Evil evil twin it wasn't me calling elizabeth was loftus twin. calling elizabeth loftus memory I, error i yeah. was All i was there, right. i was i was at a tux well then who was it uh, it was his evil twin yeah, exactly. pictures or it doesn't count. It was count. a doppel Leonard. Pictures or it didn't happen. <laughs> the so who was it. that? Who this was is why you should have taped it, Susan. Tape it next time. Some of you were here, so why don't you guys remember it? Mm -hmm. My second trivia game that week. I was exhausted. <laughs> you? <laughs> we're not the ones who are claiming to I, remember. I was doing you a favor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't move the burden of proof. Don't shift the burden of proof there. It was oh hey, somebody named iPhone is trying to in, join, but their name is iPhone. Let him in. No, 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 Michelle no. Eller. Hello, iPhone. You can always kick him out. Oh, it's Robin. Oh, kick her out! Kick her out! Kick her out! <laughs> Let me see if I can get my. She's doing bonus tonight. I can't kick her out. Where's Petunia, Robin? I am in my car. I'm at a charging station, and I can't go home until I have a little juice on my battery here. <laughs> so she says. I forgot to plug it in last night. Dumbass. <laughs> start the video. There we go. Hello. In car. We're like, who's your iPhone? I'm at the Nissan dealership. Let me see what I can do. How, how long do you have to sit there before you can be? It's charged? probably going to be or 20 minutes oh that's not so bad have you been there a while i just got second oh that's not bad oh you only have to stay long enough to charge it not to get home not i have to stay long enough to charge it enough to get home so which that's probably like a, three bars and a bit <laughs> how so long bad. is that well it depends on what kind of charger i'm on i'm not 100 i'm not, not sure if this is a 240 charger or a 110 charger if it's a 110 charger i'm probably in trouble <laughs> but i'll just keep sitting here what's going on with caspian look that is scary it's like it's like the watcher or shadow person he's in his halloween costume susan oh. uh you want to see a picture yeah i want to see yeah. text. i want to see you looking like james bond oh, look at that. telescope Ooh. operator in a tux kind of hard to tell that you're in a tux do you have do, do people have to wear tuxes to operate telescopes no yes no, no. I think okay. that's really your layer, and that's in uh, space. <laughs> yeah. well, it looks like he was he's balancing trying, he's it on his chin. Uh, that's the evil laser he was going to fire at the ISS. Yeah. He's Amish. So here's another guy wearing his tux, and it's more obvious. Uh, let me share the screen. Yeah. Florida. Yeah. Okay. I is that it. the is that the Jewish space laser though? Because that yep. looks dangerous. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, no, no. This, that, that this is facing the wrong laser. way. So it's this. The space laser. So so the person the person in this picture is not Jewish. Oh. 
So what I want to know and what is, telescope are they firing is firing the lasers over the ocean? Because it looks like you're fi firing it west. So it's safe, right? Why are they using an equatorial mount? Because that's just painful. Uh, because this telescope was built in 1883, mm -hmm. and the uh, uh, getting systems that could track and not uh, and an equatorial mount uh, in 1883 was basically impossible. <clears throat> equatorial mounts are fantastic. I hate them. Stop <laughs> Sonia. Um, Hello, Karen. If you can hear us, Leonard, do you, do you remember if the uh, if, if the uh, the thing worked exactly the same way when it was first I built? I was not around in 1983. Oh, you weren't. Okay. No. <laughs> yeah, he didn't <laughs> move around until a few years yeah. later. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at Paula's here. She's in a. Oh, she's in the. She's in the Overlook Hotel. Yeah. <laughs> So Did my history with that capability on my phone. So I'm like excited to use it finally. Cool. Scary, scary. Cool. Hello, Avi. I when? think Hello. Faith and Romero need to change your name. You need to change your name. <coughs> of Paula, Romero. are there kids on tricycles behind you? Call me of Romero and your your Louise. Bell. Very good. I think we have almost all Big Brother is watching you. <laughs> Good job. Okay, everybody looks like they're here. <clears throat> Everyone that isn't here, raise their hand. <laughs> oh, you guys, you guys. Okay. Get like in a meeting. Okay, what are we forgetting? Oh, we could tell you we're <laughs> forgetting it. What episode is this, Carl? Uh, no, just I mean in an in actual office. But every time we'd have a meeting, like they would, someone would always say toward the end of the meeting, "Okay, what are we, what are we forgetting?" Oh. Coffee and donuts. Okay, Peggy's going to start. <clears throat> Kevin is going to be next. <clears throat> Sorry, you guys. Um, Kevin, where are you on this? On Thursday, though, we did get down to some, we had a lot of people join and didn't realize that it was going to go on so long, even though it said it on the thing. So we had some rooms with two people. <laughs> that was funny. <clears throat> Kevin's going to room two. <clears throat> Carl, you are going to go to room, room three. three. Rob, you're going to go to room four. I think it's a pretty charger because I'm up to 6%. Louise Belcher. Who's Louise Belcher? 6 0. Bob's Burgers. Oh, oh is that who you are? Okay. 6 point zero. Bob's Burgers. Paula will educate me on yeah. these Bob's Burger thing. Oh, that's <laughs> great. That's a wonderful outfit. <laughs> okay, who's next, Robin? Robin's going to five. Okay, let me see if I got the rooms right. One, two. Okay, that will work. When two. Oh. <clears throat> You'll be leaving what, early, so that's. What's your nice. favorite pirate joke, Bob? Flockmeister. Um, it's kind of long. <laughs> it's um. Is that the joke? <laughs> no. Um, it's the, the guy. Oh. The guy had he had a. A hook hand, and he had a an eye patch. And he said, "How'd you lose your hand?" And he goes, "Oh, it was a terrible sword fight, and you know, I, I fought bravely, but the guy chopped my hand off like that, so they put this hook on." He goes, well, "What? How about your eye? Well, how'd you lose your eye?" He goes, "Well, we were out on the deck, and I was staring into the sun, and the seagull flew <laughs> over and crap right in my eye." They said, Does "That make you lose your eye?" Well, it was the first day with the hook. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ooh, I got a, I got a, I got a pirate joke. Uh oh, <laughs> I got a pirate joke too. There's this pirate, and he has <sighs> a big steering wheel in his, uh, in his, in his groin area. So yeah, he says to him, "Hey, why do you have that big uh, steering wheel there?" And he goes, "Ah, it's driving me nuts." <laughs> 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 the best thing about that joke is my friend Carlos tried to tell it, but he's like, 
or right, it's making me crazy and nobody nobody <laughs> <laughs> oh, better when they bring the joke. And okay, so I have that's the second part. Go ahead, Robin. How much do the pirates pay to get their ears pierced? A buck a buck. A buck. About a buck an ear. Here. Oh. I don't know, Robin. How much? <laughs> Pirates carry swords. Because <laughs> swords can't walk. Yeah. Okay, wait, here goes I said I didn't I didn't get somebody. Paula. I thought I had you in here. Oh, you're going to three. I think I got um like very short disconnected and can like an automatic so that must be have it. to kick me out. Gotta bring you guys back. Oh my goodness, it's spend the day over there. Sorry. <laughs> I know you all. I know you well now. Yeah. Susan, is that a halo? Oh, or I could put on my hat, which is like this. Oh. The fit. It was like a gunshot or something just went off. We're very concerned. Oh, really? That's interesting. Well, we have the uh, Thunderbirds here. Well, not right now. Oh, so we don't yeah. have gunshots, but we've had because the um air shows. Air is the yeah, air there was a C eighteen. I think it's called the C eighteen. Took off from Monterey Airport today, and the military planes don't show up on your flight radar. No, yeah. uh, they today. No, they, they, they always circle back over our house, and it's super annoying. When I was little, I used to get really scared. Really? Yeah, yeah but they're flying. They've been flying over my house all day. Well, what oh. they do at our house is they go low, and then because ours is like the circle off point, because they they go like across the valley, and so they always circle right back around where we live, and then go back. They're just doing to say hi to you. Definitely. They're like, let's go see what Isabel is doing. And landing. They're spreading chemtrails. <laughs> Control hey, your mind. Hey, everybody, we have a new player. Look at this. This is Isabella's friend Shasta. Everybody Shasta. say hi to Shasta. Hi, Shasta. Hey, Shasta. Hi, Shasta. Shasta. Shasta really hi. likes trivia. So I thought she'd like to come. That and because be my roommate's going out on a date, and I didn't want to be alone this evening. <laughs> <laughs> You did warn her what the what it's like being here, right? Yeah, it's very loud. Oh, and we're just a little bit though. We yeah. we will try not to uh diss you and treat you like the person you are just because you're a variant. <laughs> <laughs> Is it weird hat day and I didn't know about it? It's almost Halloween. Halloween. Come on. Halloween. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, right. costumes. Yeah. I just put mine on because I saw other people playing. <laughs> I said, I'm in. All right. I'm in. Karen's, Karen's got hers. All right. Oh, she's Deborah's gonna get hers. There you go. We got a pirate now. Arr. Everything has to start with an R. You oh, started it. Cat. You started it, Bob. Really? What is it? Kitty. It's sun hat for the sun. My that was my plan all along. I've got four zooms this week, and I'm doing them all. I much prefer this. The pirate, so, yeah. uh, pirate like flopmeister. My yeah. favorite. You put a chicken joke. on your shoulder. <laughs> my favorite pirate joke is not really a pirate joke, but it's kind of a joke. This is the thing. You and it's, do. I might, oh, I might. Then again, I might not. <laughs> are you a hippie, Karen? Oh you no, know, who are you? will learn. You will learn shortly what I am. Oh, I, I did you just call me short? <laughs> <laughs> and this is Hamilton. Shortly, she called you shortly. Is that Hamilton, Susan? Yeah, that's Hamilton. Oh, yeah. Hey, Katie, hey, Katie. Isabella. Julian, Isabella. Jeff, jealous. Hi. Hi, it's me, Hamilton. <laughs> Hi, how are you? <laughs> You're so angelic, Susan. Oh my gosh, you guys are crazy. Make me crazy, cray, cray, cray. Okay, here we go. Let's find out who's going to play the game tonight. It's so interesting. Would you come up with these weird names? Okay. Team number one, <laughs> James, Janine, Kyle, Leonard, Peggy, Isabella, and Shasta. What is your team name? The uh, Sidewalk Wrestling Wizards. <laughs> uh, okay. Let me see if I can. 
Mm. Put it in the chat for Shasta, did they, did, they, chat. did they give you a choice of colors? They just made me wear the, they gave me the dark one. What? Rob, what'd you say? I have the dark shirt. See the dark version? Oh, TWA? We didn't. TBA. No, it's not TWA. What is TBA. it? <laughs> to, to be assigned TBA? Oh, oh my shirt. Sure. It's TBA. It's from the Loki show. From on Disney Plus. See, are you oh, not saying? Are you not saying? Oh, I see. Wait, stand up, stand They're up, wearing up, matching up. shirts. Oh, yes. Oh, turn around, just turn got that. Just oh, got that. <laughs> oh, that is too freaking weird. <laughs> Oh, how embarrassing for I have the jacket. So no, it's, no, see, in this case, it's not. It's, jacket. it's okay. not embarrassing because there are, they're all variants. Spoiler. Exactly. <laughs> I don't even know what you guys are talking I about. I know you It's don't. the Disney show about a Marvel character. Yeah, I'm slightly a nerd. He's I really nerdy. Slightly. All my friends watch anime and are obsessed with Marvel. And play D&D. &D. Yeah, and we it's all play Good people. And we all it's play D&D on Friday, on Friday evenings. Instead of partying, we're in, like, the, the study room. We're in the study room playing Dungeons and Dragons for like four hours. <laughs> nice. that's, that, that's cool. I think that's more, that's part of it. We all knew this is what I was going to yeah. turn into at college. It was just bound to happen. Shafted, you got one? Did you vote yet? Did you vote? Did you vote yet? Who? Yes. Did you vote? Yes. Loki would make an awful president. <laughs> oh, I love that. <laughs> Which one? All of them. All right. Room number Any two. Of them. Room number two. It has been Jamie, Kevin, Mono. <laughs> Of, Ray, of Romero and Louise Blulcher. Oh no. What's uh -oh. the matter with Facebook? What? Oh. What's the matter? I like it. Yeah. What's the matter? I'm sad about that because I use Meta all the time and now I can't oh, the because meta. I think I'll be on Facebook. <laughs> That's their new name. Okay. This will be, tonight will be a first in the history of Susan's trivia where two teams came up with the same name. <laughs> oh, no. Almost exactly. three, because our team nearly did too. Exactly. Nobody change your name. You just do that to frustrate Susan. Is the, <laughs> um, exactly is the uh, oh, hat over the E that. there for a reason? It's it's an accent. Right, but why do we have it there? Because it's I don't. It's not in the name of face the new. No. Because Ramiro doesn't understand the English language. <laughs> oh, we were trying to help Susan. Sorry. Oh, thank you. Okay, so room number three has Adrian, Jeff, Julie, Karen, Carl, and Paula's iPhone. For the Halloween Eve, Eve, Eve. <laughs> Kevin. Very good. Okay, that, that makes sense. I understand that. That was Coven. 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 get it? Uh, ah. Leonard, you get it? Uh, uh, I, I don't want it. <laughs> he gets it, though. <laughs> um, room number four is Avi, Brandy, Caspian, Mike, Queen Jane, who is now the host, co-host, and Rob Palmer. We are... Aurora Boreoroboros. <laughs> oh, Boreoroboros. Yes. Boreoroboros. He said. Susan Boreoroboros. can't say it. That's what From counts. Washington. <laughs> Aurora Boreoroboros. 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 This is so funny. Hey, I know. After I learned how to say this, why don't you guys help me figure out how to do the, the um, scoring and add things up on the Google sheet? Yeah. <laughs> all at so, once, like you always do, and you kind of- We've done that before. Yeah, okay. Well, it was fun. We could do it again. Yeah, that'd be really funny. We um, all enjoyed it. But it was amusing. I wouldn't time, say it was fun. That's what makes it fun. Especially Susan. Especially Susan, yes. <laughs> okay, room number five, Alan, Bob, Brian Kirby, Deborah, Robin, and Wilma. What's a meta with Zucker? Oh, come on. Why are you guys coming up with this meta? What's going on? Is there something going on I should know about? No, yes. uh, nothing, nothing to worry about. Nothing, nothing that you should know about, about, but there is something going on. Nothing anybody. Yeah, Zoom is training their name to Moose. Facebook changed its name. <laughs> Did it really? I heard they were going to. They've announced it. What is no. it? 
Meta. <laughs> Meta. It's the corporate name, not the. In the same product. way, Google is Alphabet. Facebook yeah. right. will be Meta. Oh, so Facebook didn't really change its name. That's Correct. Stupid. A holding company, corporation. The company, yes. Well, they oh, did okay. because it's That's... different now on the stock market. It used to be Facebook on the stock market is yeah. Meta. Yeah. Oh. Right. Exactly the same way as Google yeah, and Google is Alphabet. Google Alphabet. 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 I don't know where they're coming out with these dumb names, but mm. whatever. And they, brother, and they pay um, enormous amounts of money to yeah. consultants to come up with these names. Stupid names. It, yeah, it's, and, a, it's amazing that naming consultant is actually like a profession, and there are whole companies that that's what they do. That's hey, fine. We're experts. What what they I don't understand us. is why people hire. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. One can pay me For a million dollars. I'll pull a name out of my ass. <laughs> failure, failure of imagination. Okay, so here we go. We're I, gonna get I think the team names are better than the company names. I name. think they should hire us. Yeah, we I'm should hire here. out. Exactly. Yeah. Seriously. So here we go. No Here's the team names. Uh, we have uh, game number 78, the Ocho from season two, episode 21 for the 28th of October in the year of our Lord of <clears throat> God. <laughs> the common error. Common error. <laughs> we have tonight our leaders are Peggy, Kevin, Carl, Rob, and Robin for bonus. Jane is handling the controls, whether she knows it or not. <laughs> and, <laughs> Queen Jane. Um, Queen Jane. The reaction was good, Jane. <laughs> I didn't see it. There's a flash of terror. <laughs> Somebody quickly show her how to mute everybody. I, okay. Okay. The team name, but not yet, not yet, not yet. <laughs> the team names are Sidewalk Wrestling Wizards versus What's the Meta, meta with for Facebook versus Halloween Eve, 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 Coven, 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 whatever. Versus Aurora Bora Babu Bobas versus what's a meta with Zaka? I got it. So who who will be? The well, you've got something. <laughs> <laughs> who will be the winner? Right now, scores are even. Everybody's on equal footing, and it's a tie. <laughs> Everybody is also in last place. Everybody's in last place, tied for first place, whatever you want to do. So we're That's going to start off with great attitude, Peggy. Carl. Hey, Peggy all get a trophy. Is about yeah. to be made a co-host. There she is. Ooh, Peggy. I'm so excited. She's so excited. And I just can't hide it. Hey, you're spoiling know, my category. I know, I know. I know. Okay, so tonight's category is just kind of Halloween-ish stuff, miscellany. <laughs> Okay, um, let Jane, let Jane. Now I need to get everybody muted so they can. Queen, Queen Jane. I, I don't know what to hey, do. Show her. <laughs> Mute everybody. I don't know how to. <laughs> show where, her do how. I, where do I go? Not Just don't hit the button that says go, end go, Zoom session. Go to Part participants. participants. Click on participants and look at the bottom. I'm working from an iPad. Oh. Can you give it to me, Susan? It's Adrian. If it's because it, it is tricky from an iPad for sure. All right, I'll let Jane off. The <laughs> I'm so limited as to what I can Apple. do. Alan loves doing it. It's the weight of the crown. <laughs> <laughs> Alan loves it. <laughs> All right. Okay. Got it. Here we go. <clears throat> Okay, Adrian, you're in. You got me. Oh, dude, I was waiting for the topic name first. Oh, sure. You already gave Halloween. it. Oh, I'm sorry, I missed it. Halloween. I'll stuff. mute. Okay, sorry. I'll mute, mute everybody. They sorry. better pay attention, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Meow. Maybe it doesn't help to pay attention. I don't know. Well, first question is. Oh, I can't even read it myself. So I'll go back here. So according to Google data, what was the number one searched for pet costume for 2020? Was it A, Chucky, B, Pumpkin, C, Cat Taco, or D, Beetlejuice? <laughs> oh, dear. There will be pictures later. All right, so. Hit enter. Oh, sorry. That is just a constant bane for everyone. Hit enter. 
Yeah, like how easy could it be, but why do we not always get it? So uh, number two is current Google Trends data projects that what will be the most popular costume in California and 13 other states for 2021. Actually, this I changed just today and I apologize. So it should say in the United States, not forget about California and 13 other states. I had to double check and it turns out that I had to change my answer. So A, Ted Lasso tracksuit, B, Squid Games tracksuit, C, which, D, sexy cat. Did just I hit enter yet? Just to yeah, continue, you, you said California should actually be replaced with the United States. Yes. Replace California and California. 13 other states should be replaced with the other United states. states with US. There you go. Yeah, these are no changing numbers, changing numbers. Halloween is so difficult. All right, number three. This one's creepy, sorry. Number three is, in 1974, a Texan named Ronald O'Brien took his son trick-or-treating, then came home and poisoned the child with candy in order to collect on a recently acquired life insurance policy on the child. What candy did he use? Did he give the child to poison him? Was it a baby Ruth, an Abba Zabba, a Pixie Sticks, or a Sweet Tarts? Oddly enough, I knew that one without having the multiple choice. <laughs> oh, I admire that. Oh, I don't know if that's something to admire. That's not knowledge. Caspian, do you did, did she give you any of those ever? Did you feel sick? You really? <laughs> What's candy? <laughs> Halloween. What's candy? What's trick or treat? Okay, number four is the Cat Fanciers Association. Some of you may be members. Recognizes 22 cat breeds that can have solid black coats. But how many breeds only come in black? There are breeds of cats? <laughs> Apparently. Well, like According four, to the I Cat Fanciers Association. I guess so. I thought they were all just cats from the, from the, from the animal shelter. They're all alley cats to us, huh? Alley cat. Number five, of the approximately <laughs> 1,000 species of bats in the world, how many drink blood? Oh, I thought it was cats. We're, we went from cats oh, to you're cats. A cat. I said cats drink blood, jeez. P plus or minus on that, Peggy? Mm, no. Oh, evil. What? You, you, no. Caspian's cheering for some reason. I'm not quite sure why. What a great question, Peggy. I appreciate the evilness of that. <laughs> I love it when, when Karen What happened to muting everybody? They're all muted. They just unmute you themselves. You said something. <laughs> it's just, it's you, just. You can unmute if you have something clever to say or. Okay, well, question. somebody just mute outside our window when you said the cat thing. So I don't oh, know I what's up here. Well. And it was like a what? loud mute. Question number six is not about <laughs> cats or bats. In the 1994 Tim Burton movie, Ed Wood, what actor won a supporting actor Oscar for portraying Bella Lugosi? Enter, enter, enter. Why aren't you? Oh my God, I have got to watch that movie. Jeez, every, it's constantly coming up and stuff. People say, oh, you gotta watch it. And I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna watch it. And I never do, so I wrote it down. All right, I'm gonna watch the stupid movie. Well, if nothing else, I've accomplished that. Your life is your life is fulfilled now. Well, perhaps, <laughs> perhaps not. Uh, oops, never mind. I ended up pasting the same one twice. That's not what we want. As long as you don't post the question. Mm -hmm. So the question is question seven. The following quote comes from what classic Edgar Allan Poe novel? I think it was his eye. Yes, it was this. One of his eyes resembled that of a vulture, a pale blue eye with a film over it. Whenever it fell upon me, my blood ran cold. And so by degrees, very gradually, I made up my mind to take the life of the old man and thus rid myself of the eye forever. You're gonna be so happy I'm on your team. Aggie, are you sure you wanna call that a novel? <laughs> 
Yeah, I, I, I agree. Is, is short story or novella all right? Yes, leave her alone. If, if you know that much, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you know the title, you know the title. <laughs> I mean, why, why do you want to help others? Because. Well, that's a fair question. If someone knows it's not a novel and you said novel, we're not going to put it, even though we might know, you know, so that's a fair question. Oroboros. Oroboros. Welcome to Trivia Shasta. If you know, <laughs> really, oh, you would know one way or the other. Welcome to Trivia with Empty. He's really enjoying this right now. <laughs> There's a whole lot of engineers here or engineer-like people. And I mean, it has to be exact or they I will resemble like, that oh. remark. <laughs> yes, you do. You very much number, resemble that. Indeed, remark. indeed. Question number eight. The classic animated TV special, It's the Great Pumpkin, Charlie Brown, was first broadcast in what year? Plus or minus? The year of our Lord. I did not plus or minus this one. Is oh, yeah, she's evil. AD or CD or CE? It's, it's well, CD? yeah, I... It's not within everyone's lifetime, but within I think would say most of, this crowd, most of this crowd knows. Question number nine: What high school mascot in Westchester County, New York, is based on a classic American short story from a collection entitled "The Sketchbook of Jeffrey Crayon Gentleman"? Now what? I'm, it's coming! It's coming! I gotta read that. That is weird. His name is Crayon. Apparently. You could be named Crayon? I, I think. That's a name? High school mascot. Oh, I'm having a problem here. Okay, come on. Come on, buddy. Here we go. Question number I 10. I thought you were a wizard. Yeah, I'm not a wizard on, on this. She's in training. Laptop. Wizard in training on laptop. So question number 10, how many people were executed as a result of the 1692 Salem witch trials? And this, you get a plus or minus two. Okay. You don't have to know it for sure. Okay, I've got a question on question nine. There's a comma after the word crayon. Is that supposed to be there or is, it not, is that just an accident? It's supposed to be there. Okay, the sketchbook of Jeffrey Crayon. Gentleman. Yeah, and then it's followed by gentlemen, yeah. I believe. It's for number up. nine, do you want like the name uh, the name of this mascot or what kind of mascot it is? I, I think they're the same. I don't think there's a difference. Okay. I don't think it's sense. a different name. I think it's the thing is the name, if that makes sense. We will when we get it right. All right, then. Now I get to take you to your breakout rooms. Yes, please. And all curse me. So go curse me. Well, we're going to be recording it, so I don't think we're going to curse you too much. Hey, Susan. Who's taking notes? Uh, we can take it if we want. You want to do, do it, Isabel? Sounds good. Okay, Isabel, let's go and do it. All right. Okay. Uh, number one, I would think is uh, C, cat taco. I mean. We were thinking okay. pumpkins because I saw a lot of pumpkins in my neighborhood. Really? Okay. And Robin did dress her dogs up as pumpkins last year. Pumpkins so. kind of basic, so that's how I was going with that. Yeah, that's what we were going The dog, a hot dog, or are they cats? No, the pumpkin. Did they say that? Oh, let me reread the question. I thought it said dogs. It didn't say dogs. It's, I thought it said dogs. Pet cops, it, said, it just said pet. Oh. Pet. So a well, dog I know there were like 18 pumpkin pumpkin dogs in my neighborhood. I remember year. seeing a lot of pumpkin dogs last year. Were up, in, uh, up in Oregon. Yeah. So let me reread the question. According to Google data, what was the number one searched for pet costume for 2020? Yeah, it wouldn't be cat taco because that's. A cat and leaves out a whole lot of animals. Uh -huh. And it wouldn't be Beetlejuice. That's too obscure. Even Chucky's not popular, even though there's no Yeah, it's pumpkin. Okay. Yeah. And Number two is B. Squid game. 
Squid Games. Squid, Squid Games, yeah. yeah. It's Squid Games, 100%. There's no yeah. way. Like, I heard, I read, was reading on... The amount of videos on TikTok I've seen of people making the Squid Games. Well, then I've on NPR, they were, I guess, like, a New York school district banned the Squid Games costumes because it promotes death. So, yeah. Oh, my gosh. That's the best way of making... Well, in, like, viral. elementary, in elementary schools. Why would an elementary schooler watch some Squid Games? I, I really don't know, because even we found a graphic, so... Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. And you have a forensic student and a nursing student who found a graphic. Oh, forensics, that. huh? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, anthropology. Ooh, I love anthropology. <laughs> mm -hmm. So physical anthropology, not... Yeah, not... biological anthropology. Okay, that's cool. And then Shasta is also another murder head, and she says number three is Pixie uh, Sticks. Da, da, da. I knew that story, so... <laughs> murder I watched a video on it recently, so it's Pixie Sticks. Oh, jeez. So <laughs> how many... Breeds come only in black. Oh, we we didn't do number three. It's it's the um. Here we did pixie six. six. Yeah. Six, okay. <laughs> um, cat fancy association record is twenty. Susan, we were thinking two, but we're not hundred. I don't know. I I all thought I I didn't really know that there was breeds of cats. There's like four that I think. Well, there's that one that has its ears that go down like this, and there's Siamese, and there's that one that's in Maine. Oh, no. That was a cop. Maine coon cat? Yeah, so those are three I know. No, there are lots of breeds. Yeah, there are a lot of breeds. So, I don't know. I don't know if it has to be a Can't be a lot. I'd expect, yeah. You know, all different breeds. My God. <laughs> okay, let's well, see. I think here. I wonder if it's zero. On uh, number five? No. Oh, for four. Oh, that could be. No, because there's there that there's come the... only in black. Oh, well, this but is a pure bread, pure bread would make sense because a pure bread means that it's been bred that way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But there is a breed of cat that comes in all black. I mean, I could see finding a cat that has an unusual color, but the right, and it wouldn't be a pure bread. There's a whole breed. In yeah, I, I, I really have no idea. I don't I don't have a I don't care. Janine's being off the mic because the why? questions are not about chickens. And James I don't know that much about chickens. Let's go with cows. Um are your chickens locked up, Janine? Chickens are in bed. Um I would, you know, so what are we what are we guessing one. for four? Yeah, I'm fine with one. Okay. How do we feel about sure. one for four? Sounds good. For me. I'm cool with that. I'm pretty sure the answer to five is three. That's what we were okay. thinking. You are thinking it was three, either three or four. Yeah, there are three species of, of vampire bats. Mm -hmm. hmm. I have no idea who played Bella Lugosi in Ed Wood. We don't either. William Shatner. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Susan. <No. laughs> he had to take his shirt off. What? William Shatner was always taking his shirt off and having. Well, we sex know that, in. Charlotte. I've watched Star Trek and basically every other movie he's been in. The shirt has to come off. It's like a. Oh, of course! Can't you see him playing Edward? I don't even know what movie this is. Yeah. I've never seen this movie. Oh, you and I both. We'll have to watch it together because I haven't seen it. Okay, yet. it's really. I'm popular. coming back in three weeks. Can I come over and see Hamilton? Yeah, of course. Okay. Yeah. I'm um, gonna go over to Susan's and see the. <laughs> <laughs> What it's following quote moment. is Edgar Allan Poe? That is the the Telltale Heart. Telltale Heart yeah. underneath the, the oh. baseboards. That was a fantastically oh, creepy man. short yeah. story. I was gonna try it was first broadcast in what year? We were talking about for six. Around 1960s? 70. I think it was like 66. I thought it was maybe 68, 68 or six or 67. I, yeah, I remember my parents saying that they were young and my parents were born in like 60 and 64. And they remember, both remember seeing the news. Your seeing it parents were born in 60? Oh my God. Hey, I'm putting up with that. I heard her it's say, hurt. and That's I kept my mouth shut. shut. You keep your mouth shut. Literally. Oh my God. <laughs> You've got kids. Yeah. And my, yes. my, 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 here we my mom was born in 1970. My mom was born in 1956. No, she wasn't. Was she? Yeah, I'm I'm oh. dead serious. She just had her birthday yesterday. Oh, yeah, yeah, she's older than I am. My mom That's was right. 61. Older than me. Oh. <laughs> okay, so what was the number eight? What are we putting? We've put I'm down just a visitor here. This is, I'm only we here put, for this. 
We put down 1968, uh, but. I'm going to vote for 66. Okay, we're cool with that. How about 67? Right in between. <laughs> I like that. Even playing field. Did you see know. it in high school, Leonard? Hell if I remember. Oh. High school? He doesn't remember high school. What high school mascot? In I went to four different high schools in two different countries, so it's oh. confused. Okay, what is the mascot? I don't even know what this is. The thinker? No. Maybe. Never heard of it. If it was the thinker. Oh, hmm. no, you would know that if it was the thinker. Yeah. The sketchbook of Jeffrey Crayon. <laughs> Never heard of that. Classic short yeah. story. Okay, what would a high school mascot in New York be kind of a snowflake? Just forget the sketchbook of, of Jeffrey Crayon. Yeah, there's a lot of variety. A tree, um, a leaf. I think it's going to be something more specific with a name, like the thinker. You that's know, a very literary high school, apparently. I would think, right? Because the wild taking a from a, a private high classic. Yeah, what would they call would themselves? Like the bookworms, the the knights. Yeah. The knickets. The knights who say me. me yeah, me. exactly. Yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know what would they say. Here's Peggy. Everybody be good. She's coming to watch us. We love you, Peggy. Want some jello, Peggy? It's green jello time. Ooh, jello. Okay, Susan, the dining hall here has literally their jello is like, like, it's horrible. It sucks. I don't know. I don't like jello. I don't like most food. You don't like most food. Yeah, yeah the jello is horrible. Everything, the all the food's horrible. The, the dining hall is kind of the trash. salad is like I've never had a bad salad in my life, and the salad's really bad. And I miss my mom's cooking, and I'm dying. Aww, but you're meeting nice friends. I know I do have lots. I have weird friends. Sorry, That's cool. and you're playing Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> I know, I know yeah, I'm no, I, I know I'm weird. I, I spend all my days spending like I literally spend my weekends playing Dungeons and Dragons. So who's and watching, the mascot? And watching Formula One, huh? Who would be the mascot? What would be a mascot? It's got to have the some what? kind of name that's unusual. You can't. The dragons. No, they're not going to call themselves the dragons. Ooh. And it's after a book. You, it's got to have something specific. What if Has anybody like, the read witches? the sketchbook of Gotham? The Witcher. <laughs> How about a crayon? A crayon? <laughs> His name is Crayon. It's a weird name. Yeah. His parents have issues if they name their kid Crayon. No, it's their last name. It's the family name. Last name. The Sketchbook name. of Jeffrey Crayon. I don't like it. I have no idea. Let's skip that for the moment. Um, I think number 10 is... It's under 10. Um, I think it's 10? under 10. Or it's under 20. So it's it's not like 100. It's a number that oh, executed? I think it's like, yeah, it's like 8. Well... Uh, I think it's just under 20. I think it's teens. Yeah, something in the teens. Yeah. Well, I, I, I think 14 keeps standing out to me. I'm not sure why. 16 jumped out yeah. at me. I would, well, I would, go, said, I would is, go higher. Is this 15? 15? 18 or something? Yeah, this is like executed. <laughs> executed. Okay. So uh, let's say like, 17 and then that 18. way 18. it gets us to 19 and it gets us to 15 because there's a 2 plus or minus. Okay. Yeah, and, and they were executed by hanging, not by burning at the stake. Oh, that's pleasant to know. Thank you, Leonard. I yeah. have this vision now of people being hung and not burned at the stake. Thank you. Oh, yeah. okay. One so, the, if, and one of them was my relative. What? Susan, uh -huh. I have a show that Caspian will like. It's on Netflix and it's called The Witcher. It's really good. It's really good, especially if you liked um, Game, Game of, of Thrones. Thrones. It's really good. Well, tell them. really into it. He doesn't okay. live with me. I heard. I see him as much as you do. <laughs> Susan. <laughs> oh. Okay, oh, we've got on. two to get. Okay, okay. number nine. Are you guys nine. gonna put seventeen for ten? Okay, and we need six. one for six and nine. What was six? I thought we were putting down William Shatner. <laughs> <laughs> Leonard Nimoy. No. I like William Shatner. That's just me. Um, he did go into space recently, so I don't think he would have played a good Bella the Ghosty. Probably not. Um, 
Okay. How about that guy that that does all the creepy stuff with the voice that does um <laughs> Vincent, Price. Vincent Price. Vincent Price. Okay. Okay, come up with something for the mascot quick. Eagle. No, it can't be an eagle. How about Dragon. No. Crayon. 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 Yeah. He's doing if you go down to your uh, video, if you're on a uh, lap uh, computer, you can do um, a little costume. You can put a costume on your face. Oh, or a halo. Mine won't do that. Or Saint Susan. Oh. Saint Susan of trivia. <laughs> Saint Susan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's cray cray. Is this everybody? This is everybody, right? It's everybody. All righty then. Let excellent me... brian excellent <laughs> brian share this. you need to be closer to the camera though oh all right so oh my god is he oh, drinking what oh is he eating is he eating chocolate Hershey syrup so here we go is everybody seeing this become a Halloween thing like trivia yeah like yep. slicing good Snickers job brian <laughs> <laughs> oh. no Number way one. Cat taco. No way. That's crazy. That's cute. Humans are mean though. Hamilton, where are you? I, I don't know why it wasn't Chucky. It should have been Chucky. Ah. Cute, but it's torture. Oh, this category oh, is Squid Games. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Just a week ago, it would have been Witch. Wow. And it is within the last <laughs> week that it changed to Squid Games. How could it not be Squid Games? My goodness. Well, because which, which, which is like his wearing Squid Game costume. Uh, yeah, Why is there a kid in Squid Games costume? costume? Not everybody has Netflix. And everyone so are those people costume. dead or are they everybody just... Everybody has Netflix. They're not they're dead, dead yet. What they're are they doing like that? Oh, no, not dead yet. Like that? They'll be they're probably dead in a minute. What was number one? What was number one? Cat Taco. Cat Taco. Cat Wicked Wicked games. So has anybody seen one of these costumes yet? Are, are the costumes just covered in blood and gore? Because it should be, clearly. Oh, no, I don't even want to watch it. They want to be able to wear them to school. Don't watch it. It's really spooky. The answer should have been Taco really Cat good. because it's a palindrome. The candy. No, so the pixie sticks. Mm. Did anybody not choose the pixie sticks? Oh, <coughs> glad you talked me into that. I didn't think that was it. <coughs> yeah, I knew. He was, he he was the only one that you could man. easily put poison into. Yeah. That well, I, is I thought I remembered a pill being stuck in, in a baby Ruth. So Wait, they, what's this? You a Bombay? It's called hey. a Bombay. Dang it. Developed by an idiot. But yeah, they only come in black. Oh, I never heard of them. Yep. We were only off by one. Yeah, sorry. So we, oh, we get it for changing our answer. Oh, well. There hey. were people, some of the teams got this one. I'm so oh, Did I not say three? Damn. Three species of bats who drink blood. And uh, I'm impressed. Like, that should have been a multiple choice, but somebody so, got it. So so. The logic was, yeah. since there are so many Not numbers, me. Peggy wouldn't do that because it would have to be obviously just one. <laughs> and I said, well, then if that's not right, if it's not one, she is evil. So there you go. I'm she evil. evil. <laughs> yeah, that's I'm a, evil. That's it's Halloween, Rob. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think probably <laughs> almost everybody got this one, unless you're super young or something. Yeah. Nobody in our team got it. Everybody got this one. Wow. I missed yep. I misnomered it as a novel, and it is a short story, as I checked while you guys were talking about it. But I think everybody got it, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 That, William the Shatner, who played <laughs> Bella Lugosi. Number eight is 66. I know at least one team got 1966. Wait, wait, what was the plus or minus on that? Give plus or minus. There is I didn't one. do oh, on that one. Evil, evil. It yeah, was evil. I agree. But you 66, one year away. come on. Look at that, look at that. That's, it says 66 all over it. It's iconic. Um, Peggy, well, at the top Peggy. it said 66. Yay. Why did you hey. choose two Peggy pictures? Horseman. Why did you choose those two images from the show, Peggy? Because they came up kind of early oh. in my search. <laughs> 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 Sally's pissed. I know, and I like her. Oh, yeah, I liked her. I like Sally right now. Because, because you know, she is pissed. By the end of this evening, she doesn't have any candy, and she's pissed off. She fell for it again. See, mm -hmm. now that makes sense. Oh that my God. Can... We, 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 we sussed that out. Yep. We didn't mm -hmm. even get close. 
it's, we got it's, it. We, it's weird. It's very weird. Yes, it is. But you know, there are all kinds of. These how, how does a how does a dead guy ride a horse? That's what I want. Yeah, you, you gotta like listen that. to the story. Apparently, very well. Mm-hmm. So this is your plus or minus category. Oh, Twenty. Yay. Twenty oh. were executed. Yay. Nobody got burned at the stake. Nineteen were hanged. One oh. was pressed to death with stones. You know, lucky guy. That was one of the men. Fourteen were women. Six were men. What was the question? How many were executed as a result of the Salem witch trials? Oh. Plus or minus two. So if you got anything okay. from 18 to 22, you are right. Okay. Good 19. So can we have bonus points if we got it exactly right? Uh, that wasn't <laughs> no. no. <laughs> but you could get a pat on the back for that. Uh, but I talked them into witch costumes, so that sucks. Well, yeah. you were right last week. If we'd have done it last week, it would have been witch. Yeah. Damn so it. We're going to make her an overly well done steak and burn her steak. <laughs> um, <laughs> Happy Bye. Halloween, everyone. Very Happy good. Halloween. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. <laughs> good category. Good category. Nice ears, Alan. A nice, nice variety <coughs> of uh, Halloween stuff there. I'm just putting the last of the, the, the answers and I was off one like row on this. So I have to just move these a little bit. Alan, you look so funny where's alan <laughs> oh that that's normal for alan that's one of his normally you have to have a filter to get rid of that <laughs> <laughs> anyway. i really like that one <laughs> i like that one you know, i didn't think it was that fun uh, it was funny <laughs> Did, did Jay send some stuff over for you to drink today, Susan? No, no, no. I just had some Jello. Mmm, oh. Jello shots. I get, it. That Jello. I get it. Jello. <laughs> okay, so let's go to the scores. <clears throat> All right, Peggy's team, which was Sidewalk Wrestling Wizards. What did you get? We get six. Six. What the um, right? what the meta with Facebook? Six. Ooh, can we get another six? Ooh, that would be, so <laughs> <would> be appropriate. <laughs> Halloween Eve, 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 Kevin. Eight. Ooh. Dang you, you're supposed to get six. We're two more evil than that. Dang. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, Aurora or Borobiobius. Five. <laughs> drop the whole ritual, man. Five? Five. Your favorite number. You're playing the long game in case somebody else joins uh -huh. right now. Exactly. You get them on your team. We think we'll see the next What's the meta with Zucca? Six. Yeah. yeah. I think the Roya or Roby or Oreo Oreo Bora Thank you, Caspian. That was Caspian. Yep. You little booger. Or Boros. Just remember Pixie Sticks. I'm taking them out. I'm taking out of the taking them off the roll. You'll never suspect Pixie Sticks. Honey, don't forget the life Pixie insurance Sticks. policy, Susan. Life insurance first. <laughs> oh, Pixie stick, sweetie. It's yummy. Okay. <laughs> then we are followed by Kevin. God, I can't find you people on the screen. Where are you, Kevin? Oh, I'm the Kevin. guy talking oh, that right is now. Creepy. Oh, man, that is creepy, creepy. Oh. Aww. That's yeah. the guy from the Twilight Zone. Oh. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Spoiler, spoiler. Go for it, Kevin. Oh, my category <clears throat> has nothing to do with Halloween. Oh, what? My category is one hit wonders music. I'm going to give you lyrics and you're going to have to name the song and the artist. Wait, half a you point. only can do one. That's two well, points. I'm going to do half said. a point. Okay, then a full point if you know the song. Okay. I was so going to do half a point the answer? Wait, wait. So no, I wanted to do half a point for the no artist, half points. Half point no, half points. no half points. Okay, so we'll do one full point for the title of the song. Okay, title of the song. Thank you. Hey, I'm going to mute everybody in three, two, one. Don't forget to unmute yourself, Kevin. Yeah, I don't have to say much. I'm just going to stop posting them. Adrian should be a flight attendant or something. She's just got that voice. Okay, everybody. We're gonna it's all it's all in the mic. 
I, 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 that he, she uses for there's number one responders. i've never heard a flight attendant giggle <laughs> they do in the back haven't you heard everyone of take your seats we may be going clock. down <laughs> <laughs> i'm muting myself after that <laughs> okay here we go there's Aren't number you two You're not singing them? Nope. All right. You want me to run through say like them. a... Say them or say something. Yeah, say something because we, we're people who's watching this video can't hear it. Well, yeah, want me to play it through... Of... Um, I can play it through like what Rob does. Yeah, yeah. That's fine. Okay. If you got it. Okay, yeah. yeah I can, if you, uh, if you I can, didn't prepare uh, it in advance, it prepared for it to read some words really badly. So I don't know. Maybe it's better yeah. to just read it. I think you should read it. Um, no, because I'll sing it. Sing it's even better. Okay, so I'll read it because I don't know any of these. <laughs> well, it's okay. only got two. Oh, that's fine. Oh, that'll be worse. Well, I'm just guessing. I'm not. Them. Prepare yourself. You know it's a must. Gotta have a friend in Jesus. <laughs> so, <laughs> Jesus. So you know that when you die, he's going to recommend you to the. What happened yep. there? That's it. That's okay. the end of it. The next okay. line is the no. next okay. Song. All right. Thank you. Number two. Sometimes I feel I've got to run away. I've got to get away from the pain you drive into the heart of me. The love we share seems to go nowhere, and I've lost my light. For I toss and turn. I can't sleep at night. Once I ran to you, I ran. Now I'll run from you. <laughs> that, that one sounds vaguely familiar. <laughs> Rob, this is great. <laughs> I think Karen should read the rest of them. We no, should take Karen. Karen knows no, these. No. I think you should try doing it with a Christopher Walken accent next. I can't do Christopher Walken. Do Rob Palmer. I think Carl, Rob if you could do Christopher Walken, go for it. Number three, poor old Johnny Ray. Sounded sad upon the radio. Moved a million hots in mono. Our mothers cried, sang along, who blamed them? You're grown, you're grown up, so grown, so grown up. Now I must say more than ever. So is that really hard to not to give it away as you're reading it? I'm trying specifically yeah, but... not to sing. Number four, Knights of the Air, ride super high tech jet fighters. Everyone's a superhero everyone's a captain kirk with orders to identify to classify to clarify and classify scramble in the summer sky number five here's a little song i wrote you might want to sing it note for note. Blankety, 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 blank. In every life, we have some trouble, but when you worry, you make it double. Can I be on Karen's team? <laughs> Number six. Oh, by the way, these were all Certified number one songs, except for number one. Number one, I don't think was a number one song, but it's definitely a, a, a one hit wonder. The guy who wrote the number one question was asked once what it meant to him. And he said, I have a house. I have a summer house. I wrote one song. Ooh. Anyway, the rest of them are all number one hits on Billboard magazine between the 60s and the late 90s, I believe. Oh, the mid 90s. Number six, radio video, boogie with a suitcase. Go living in a disco, forget about the rat race. Let's do the milkshake, selling like a hot cake. Try some, buy some, be five, bo bum. Talk about. I think that was That's a little bit of singing there. Sing. He's trying to give it away. I'll sing. Uh, that Kevin? Was it. Kevin, can I ask, uh, you mentioned about some guy who bought, uh, spoke about his house and so on. Yes. Which answer was that? That was number one. Number one, one is the only one that wasn't a number one song. Oh, okay. And the guy who wrote it. Okay. Yeah. Number seven, got to make a move to a town that's right for me. Town to keep me moving. 
keep me grooving with some energy. Well, I talk about it, talk about it, talk about it, talk about it, talk about, talk about, talk about moving. Got to move on, move on, got to move on. Won't you take me to? Oh, what is the name of it? Number eight, rubbing oh. sticks and stones together makes the sparks ignite. And the thought of loving you is getting so exciting. Sky rockets in flight. What a romantic guy you must be, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't write these songs. <sighs> the thought of loving you is getting trying so to be exciting. monotone. Sky rockets in flight. <laughs> Because if I even, if I do any other way, the that's it makes a big difference being said than just reading it to me. Hey, once I was a boogie singer, playing in a rock and roll band. I never had no problems burning down the one night stands. And I think, oh, there's more to it. Hold on, there's two more paragraphs to that one. I thought it was, there's more to number nine. All right, I don't want to sing it though. Number 10 is pretty hard. Wait, wait, you're not gonna do the rest of nine for the people listening to this later? I, uh, okay, and everyone and everything around me got to start to feeling so low. And I decided quickly, yes, I did, to disco down and check out the show. Yes, they were dancing and singing and moving to the grooving. And just when it hit me, somebody turned around and shouted. Oh, you almost got it. I got it. Right, Kevin. Number 10. This is a tough one, I think. I hear her voice in my mind. I know her face by heart. Heaven and earth are moving in my soul. I don't know where to start. Tell me, tell me the words to define the way I feel about someone so fine. Somebody's we behind. Need the, we need the artist or the name of the song? song? The name of the song. Okay. The name of the song. The artist is kind of hard too for artist. most of these, but go with the name of the song. And that's it. Any questions? Nope. Um, when, when we get to the answers, are you playing and playing audio? So I will remember. Yes. To to pause. Yes, okay. I will if you want. Yeah, that's fine. Just make sure I turn off the audio. Okay. So get dinged. <clears throat> okay, Kevin, you sending us to our rooms? Oh, is that how it works? Oh, wait, I have a question first. Yep. Does, like in some of them, it's clear where like, it seems like the next word is like you have a space where the title comes in is that true of all of them i believe like, so what? I, that, that would be giving it away Maybe. i believe it's it's the enough information there to name the title of the song okay now it says open all rooms is that what i do push that yep. button yep. okay see you in a little bit i got six okay seven. I, I got, got a couple, a couple but they're probably the same. I, got six. I just need three, four, six, and ten. The first oh. one is Spirit in the Sky. Yes. Spirit in the Sky. Number two is Tainted Love. Sometimes yeah, that's I it. feel I've got to. Bop, bop, Susan, I'm in the wrong room. Way. I'm sorry. Can you fix me? Where are you? Hey, oh. hey, hey she's not supposed to be in your room. I didn't, I didn't stop in the, I didn't stop. I'm not looking. I don't know what you guys oh, like, have. What room do you belong back in? To the main room. I belong in one. Your number one. Okay. My eyes are closed. Uh, you're in room two right now. So I need to move Peggy to room one. There you go. Yeah. Bye. Let's go uh, to room one. All right. We got She's a witch. Two. She's a witch. Yeah, I already put two down. <laughs> I figured that one out. No way. Uh, I've got two. Three. So three. Anybody know three? Coral Johnny Ray sounded sad upon the radio. Move the moon, hearts and mono. Our mothers cried, sang along to blame them. You're grown up, you're grown up, so grown up, so grown up. I must say more than ever. No idea. 
Yeah, I don't know either. This is monos because it says mono in there. There's mono. <laughs> All right, let's move on to four. We can come back. Knights of the Air, right? I know the lyrics because I remember the Captain Kirk reference and the. And I remember high tech jet fighter. And then hearing pew pew. No idea. Okay. They may do a tune. Be a rhythm at all, Ben. What? A rhythm at all to this song? Because Kevin, you might want to go visit other rooms because we're. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I just hear the sounds pew pew in my head after high tech jet fighter. Mm -hmm. I have no idea for five. Don't worry, be happy. Yeah, yeah don't worry. Be really? Happy. Yep. Don't worry. Here's a little be song happy. I wrote. You might want to sing it note for note. Don't oh. worry. Be, be happy. happy. Anybody know six? I don't know this one. Yeah, it's um, um radio, video, boogie with a zoom case. Go live in heaven. Did I get right? I funky Yeah, won't you take me to the hot kid? Okay. Some, buy some D5 from talk about it's mm -hmm. called um. Talk about, uh, shoot, talk about. Because he's cutting it off right before the title. Of the yeah, song. and the title is right there. Talk about, let me think. It's from the, it's from the disco era. Go live in the mm -hmm. Oh my God, try some, buy some, feet by feet. Number eight is Afternoon oh, Delight. Afternoon Delight. Yeah. Funky Town. And number nine is Play That Funky Music White Barn. Yeah. Lay down the boogie and play um, the boogie. Oh, what's, the, what's the actual title? Is it? Play that funky music, I think. Oh, it's amazing that that was a one hit wonder. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I my boy is probably not in the title. Because it's, uh, I mean, it's so popular. I think they would have done other stuff. Yeah. I hear her voice in my mind. I know her face by heart. Heaven Earth is moving in my soul. I don't know where to start. Oh, that one just hmm. sounds so boring. Hmm. Falling asleep looking at it. Um, radio, video. It's it's like that, isn't it? Radio, video. It's a disco song, almost rap, I think. Boogie with the suitcase, go living in a disco, forget about the rat race. Let's do the milkshake, sound like a hot like a bison. Buy some, try to some, buy some, feet by foe. Talk about it. Talk about it. Talk about it. Talk about it. No, that's the, that, that's the next uh, song, Funky Town. It's some um, music, right? Talk about music. Yeah. Blank music. Talk about. Yeah, you're right. Talk about. Something um, music. Something music. Talk about. Oh, it's like a Danish group or something. Oh, like yeah. Was Abba wasn't a one hit wonder. Oh, no. Let Jamie get it. I think he's on the verge. <laughs> I, have, um, I just heard the song. I have it on my I have it on my phone. Talk about, talk about music something. Yeah. Um, like, talk about music. Something, uh, something music. It's talk it's about, not pop music, um, is it? Well, it pop music. Pop music. music. That's it. Pop music. That's pop it. music is pop that? Music. Do we oh. think that's the name of the song? Yeah. Pop, yes. pop yes. music. Nope, pop music. Right. Oh, is that's that the right music. one? Nope, that's on the wrong one. It's down here. Pop music, something like that. Yeah, yeah. that's it. Pop music. You're pop good music. job, that's Jamie. Yeah. Whoever that's came it. up with the name, because that's boy. That's it. We we put our heads together on that one. We did good. We knew we'd heard it. Was I was like, at first catchy. I didn't even recognize it, and then as Susan started saying the lyrics, I'm like, wait about, wait a minute. Because it's that talk about, and then there's that talk part. about. Yeah. And then I was it's like, it's, music. Music. Yeah. it's something. I just couldn't think of what. So we don't have All right. 10. So we just need three four and four. And yeah, four three and ghost four. Riders in the sky. Ghost Riders in the sky. Wait, that's a song. I might yeah, be able to do four. See. I don't, I don't, I, know. When I, hear I don't jet know three at all. Pew, pew, 
and then because like Captain Kirk is a later Riders one. in the sky. No, Riders in the storm. Is that a song? Yes, Riders on. No, that's that's the Doors. Oh, no, I don't yeah. think that's it. You gotta be careful. I don't think if you, if you sing other melodies, mm. then it's totally gonna throw people off. You screw you up. Yeah. Um. It's a female voice. On which one? Singing, if I remember correctly, number four is the one I'm concentrating on because I don't, I have no clue on three. I'm trying to work on four. No idea. Uh, are those the only two we have? Ten. Um, yes. Okay. Four and ten. ten. Oh, ten also. Number ten. No, we That's, got ten. That's we did. What is oh, it? Got no, ten. We didn't. We didn't. Yeah, yeah, that one was putting ten. me to sleep. I, those words are boring. Hmm. When you see the words like this, boy, it really makes you think there isn't much poetry in this, is there? Face by heart. Heaven and earth are moving in my soul. I don't know where to start. Tell me, tell me, tell me. The words to define the way I feel about someone. It's a slow song. Tell me. This woman of mine. The word. What did you say? A woman of mine? This woman of mine. This woman of mine? Or I'm not sure how the, the rhyme so is. Like mind, heart, soul, start me, define, fine. Like I don't know where the. This woman of mine? Yeah. No idea. Never heard of it. I'm trying to figure out what could possibly match the rhythm. Mm. Tell me, tell me the words to define the way I feel about someone so fine, this woman of mine. That kind of makes sense, unless somebody has... Uh, uh, there's nothing rhyming with soul. Bowl, roll, bowl, bowl. I have to say that it's going to rhyme with soul. I just didn't know if maybe because it doesn't, that didn't have a rhyme yet in the lyrics. Yeah. How's everybody doing, Kevin? I think it's time. No, it's not time yet. I don't know if we're going to get these. But number 10, this woman of mine. We don't have anything better. Yeah, I'm fine with that. <laughs> Or of, I mean, it's probably a little bit, whatever. Okay, go back. Oh, to gosh, I wish I know four is going to bug me the minute I hear this. Or I'm going to kick title. myself when he says what it is. Can yeah. you give us any kind of rhythm on that? I take you if I do. How about the part about Captain Kirk? Everyone's a Captain Kirk. Everyone's a Captain Kirk. Not like that. Everyone's Captain Kirk. In order to identify, to clarify, and classify, scramble in the summer sky. Oh, yeah. That's all I can think of. It's, it's got a pew pew in it? Like after jet fighters, there's like a pew pew sound after. Yeah. Everyone's Everyone's I bet you when he plays it, I'm going to know what it is. No idea. It's like from the 80s. So you have everything except for two answers, I see. Is that what I'm looking at? Yeah. yeah. No idea. Thankfully, I don't know. Do you think everybody else is about the stuck? Because I don't. Yeah. Think... Yeah. yeah. Number three, put Black Velvet, even though I know that's not that song. Black for which? For three? You know that song, Black Velvet and that little boy smile. It's a song about Elvis. Is it really? Oh, Black Velvet Paintings, that song? Yeah. No, Black Velvet, not Black Velvet Paintings. Black, now, Velvet, Black Velvet, Velvet Elvis, because they sell Black Velvet Paintings of Elvis. That's what it's about. Don't be helping us or not helping. I'm not helping you. It's not the right answer. That wasn't a number right one song. Answer. <laughs> that wasn't Hope a number one song. Ray sounded sad upon the radio. Moved a million hearts in mono. I'm a little surprised. <laughs> pew pew. Oh, Johnny Ray. 
No more pew pew. <laughs> I have no idea. No idea. Kevin, go back to the main room and call us back. It's okay. <sighs> it's time. So you have to call us back to the main room. Okay, so I go to breakout rooms. Or how do I go back to the main room? Call I just room. leave room. Yeah, leave yeah. room. Mm -hmm. So we just don't have anything for three and four. Or ten, really. We put something for ten, but we don't. Yeah, but... for ten? I put what you suggested. Okay. I put this woman of mine. This woman of mine. It's a good title of something if it hasn't been taken already. I still I kind of bugs me. I hear four. Everyone's a captain bird. We're high tech check. With orders to a dinner bar. Everyone's a superhero. Everyone's a captain. Scramble bird. in the okay. summer's eye. Clarify and classify. Scramble in the summer sky. It's almost, I mean, it's sung, but it's close to spoken. You know what I mean? From, yes, from what I'm remembering. It's, there's like synthesizers. You know, and there was, uh, uh, when you mentioned one guy who said he, he the composer got built his house and all that, that was a um, daydream believer. But no, it doesn't fit any of these. Number number one is the sky. We we the in and out situation <laughs> where in and out they don't want to enforce it. They oh, in had and a couple out. of stores closed, but you're going to do it bit by bit. It's not going to be a quick. They can't force everyone to do it all at once altogether. Yeah, so I just asked the federal asked government friends. no jurisdiction over that. The the Supreme Court already ruled on that in that. Uh, uh, renter case, uh, the rent case. Well, it's, I mean, it's, it's I think it's, it, like I said, it goes slowly through court. So some stuff gets upheld, some stuff not. You guys ready for answers? Yeah. yeah. So you want me to turn off your own? Yeah, you might not want to record. And names down. Instead, it would have been about, you know, four or five left, less points, I think. Or if you would have given us extra points to identify the various fonts used in each of those. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, for for Susan's benefit, paste the answers into the chat. Oh no! It's Alan and Bobby. Oh, oh. My God. wow! Alan, look at that stash. Wow. <laughs> so, Kevin. Interestingly, in your YouTube feed on the sidebar there, I saw that's interesting what comes up in your feed there. I saw a puppy gets thrown into lion cage. <laughs> what was could it? See, could we see that, please? No. Yeah, no. no. <laughs> Helen, Helen, what are you you can Google it later. Helen, was that you with Zubin Meta? What is it? Was it you with Zubin Meta too in one one of those? Oh, yeah. That was Zubin Meta. Yeah. Z Zubin Hang on. Um, I don't know which one it was. Uh, all right, you can search for it later, Brian. Yeah, what was he? What was he? You was saying it was puppies being thrown into a blender or something. What? Mm. No, no. Said, never mind. It's not important. <laughs> so uh, so uh, wait, let me point out something with lyrics, by the way, because I've done this like five times. And 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 a lion cage. And to get the lyrics, I will put you know so and so name song lyrics and. Google presents a page, which is just Google giving you the lyrics. Often they're wrong. And there's like nothing you can do to correct it. Cause like I'm playing the song also, cause I, I you know, I make a copy and I, that's not what it says. I'm pretty sure it's not what it says. And then you Google deeper and you find a place that has it the way you think you hear it. And, uh, and it clearly makes sense as opposed to what's on the Google page. So there's a problem there. And I don't know like how widespread that is but I've come across it a lot. There's a You're lot too of time busy they editing Wikipedia to try to figure that out. Oh yeah, yeah. Are 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 you claiming Google can be wrong? Yeah, and they're presenting it like this is, and that's their first return, and it gives you all the lyrics right on the Google page without even going anywhere else. Interesting. It's, all right, yeah. so let's go with Aurora or Bori or or a Borarius or a A B Ori Ori Boris nine. Or it's a robberus. It's Bora or robberus. Susan, I can listen to you say that all night. <laughs> <laughs> it's a niner. Until they get it right. It's a robberus. It's right. Or we or robberus. Or our or rob. It's actually. I looked this up. It's pronounced Yoroboros. 
with the well, yeah. yeah well you're Ouroboros. <laughs> yeah yeah but you're not you're not you're not saying when like you did the same thing you told me but we've added the b because you wanted to sound like it's, borealis it's, it's pronounced baba buoy <laughs> <laughs> it's or or Bob it's Aurora. Washington. Yeah. <laughs> Bob Aurora's. If you guys uh, don't know what it's a made up word, which isn't a real word with a part okay, of a real word you. in it. So, so yeah. what did you get for your freaking score, you Aurora people? He said nine three times. <laughs> yeah. well, I didn't hear it. <laughs> so that's, so that's 27. You problem. 27, but 27. We need it. <laughs> okay, so what's the matter with Zucca? What's the matter with Zucca? Oh, Woo! Whoa! What? Yeah, I that one might have been easier. Daniel, what was the you. answer? Brian had that last one. I can't I hear you. What was the score? Ken. Seriously? Yes. Who knew him? I, Brian I knew. had the last one. The angel I knew. one? No, that was I Bob. That. Mostly oh, Brian and Bob, but some of us knew some of the other ones. Wow. You need Kevin to paste the answers in the chat. We all knew two of them. Okay, so question. Yeah, I'll do that. On. So, how about sidewalk wrestling wizards? If I could see eight, I'm throw it backwards. Over What's going on over his Jasta? Huh? What are they doing? Oh, we were <laughs> throwing socks at her. I bought everyone socks in our in our all of our friends matching socks. Okay. Uh, what's <laughs> the What's the matter with Facebook? I got seven. Seven. <laughs> that sounded depressing. Oh, that was the team I was. That was the team the oh Kevin was on. All right, so this was the team in the lead. Let's see if they held the lead. Oh, Halloween Eve, 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 Coven. Nine. And they retained the lead. Look at that. Yosh, you're holding on there now. You're holding on. Yeah, Kevin, have you ever been to Malden to see the Norman Greenbaum Spirit in the Sky mural? No. Spirit. Well, go check it out. Here's the answers. Come it's going to take me a bit, a minute to post them all. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's very cool. Right, that's uh, in Malden, Massachusetts. Um, they did a big mural because I guess uh, Norman Greenbaum went to, went to school there. Went to high school there. No idea. Okay, so we have five minutes. Go. You take a picture? Oh, yeah, yes. Okay, everybody get on the screen. Robin, get on the screen. Yeah, my prop. Grab your Halloween stuff. I gotta lower some of my hair though. There I am. Caspian. Caspian. And Peggy. I cannot be on video right now. Ooh. Then don't. I, I don't know if I want to. That's crazy. Okay. Peggy. Very pixie ominous. Sticks. All right. He's snorting pixie sticks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everybody ready? Okay, one, two, three. Got it. All right. All right. Here you go, Mino. Yep. Five minutes. Okay. Well, Five minutes. Dogs. Go. I'm here. Good night, everybody. I'm going to good night. 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 So All this right. one, it's so like I got Zubin Abby. made a Zubin oh, made a yeah, here, yeah. and uh, Bernstein here. There's Bernstein. Oh. So did you play in the orchestras when they were conducting? And is that Frank Zappa with Leonard Bernstein? That's right. That's right. Uh, no, the, yeah. I, well, the, the the with Meta, I think I I, I was playing the uh, the ring, the uh, you know the Wagner uh, the opera. Yeah. And uh, this was uh, at uh, Ravinia, you know, in Chicago in the summer. And this was I was with a youth orchestra playing with him at that uh, Tanglewood with uh, with Bernstein. Oh man. Uh, uh, that's Frank Zappa. That would have been so right. cool. And I don't know who I don't know who the hell else is here. I don't know if you know any oh, yeah. of these guys. Chick Corea. Oh, wow, Chick Corea. Chick Corea. I don't know. Scientologist. If you know really? That, yeah, he's a Scientologist. Oh, Ooh, Debbie Reynolds. Reynolds. Debbie oh, Reynolds. Uh, that was the that was the best concert I ever played with her. She was hysterical. And uh, James, Earl James Jones. Earl Jones. Oh. All he has to do is talk. And I was a Celtic yeah. guy. Who's got the noise on? Is that is that Robin? Yeah. Yeah, I think it's Robin. Yeah. Anyway, all right. Sorry, I'll get this off. Cool. No, I was Thank you. Is Zubin made cool. us still alive? Yeah. What's that? Nine up. I'm gonna go 
He said, is Zubin Mehta still alive? Like a little snack. Uh, I, I believe he is, yeah. He's pretty much retired, but he's, but, uh, but uh, yeah, he's, he's getting up there, but uh, Get a little yeah. Kit Korea just passed away. Yeah. Yeah. I've never even heard of him outside of Scientology, but I guess he's a big deal. Oh, he is wonderful. Wonderfully talented. Yeah, Ch Chick Corea, yeah, yeah. We, I think we premiered a, uh, uh, a concerto that he wrote uh, for orchestra and piano. Oh, I see. Well, good for you to think to get pictures. Those things are so wonderful to have, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, you know, I tell you what, I've made a point now and I'm sorry I didn't do this a long time ago. When I, when I, when I, uh, although I've never played with uh, with McLean, but um, but um, you know, I don't, I don't want autographs. I don't care about autographs. I, I, if I get a chance to play with somebody, I want a picture. Yeah, you know, but I I've agree. Done, we, I did a, I did a concert a few years ago. Um, Quadrafina, you know the uh, with oh. um, what's his name from the was it the Who? Yeah. Um, Quadrophenia? What? Yeah, who? that's the word. Who? What, what, uh, Quadrophenia. Uh, who? who? <laughs> what? Oh, come on. What, uh, uh, Townsend. Um, Pete Townsend? Pete Townsend. Pete. Roger yeah. Daltrey. So, but, yeah. And we had like, we had Townsend, um, uh, uh, I think Billy Idol, and um, God, I forgot who the other guy was. You know, these guys are great. And and the interesting thing was that, you know, they weren't, they, they, keep, they keep these guys all separate in a separate room, you know, and, you know, you can't get in there in the whole business. But we all wanted to get pictures with these guys. And we were ready to start the concert and Townsend standing right behind me. So I just turned around to him. I said, do you mind if I get a picture with you at the end of the concert? He says, nah, take it now. You know, and they all went, out, they went out of their way to make sure that they, they all got pictures with everybody. You know, it's oh, it's so fun. Funny. It's fun to do that. I got a couple. There's me and Pat Benatar. Yeah. Cool. Wow. Could she answer any of the questions? <laughs> there's, there's me and the Pope. No. <laughs> <clears throat> there's me and the guy from Toy Story. Yeah. <laughs> there's me and Greg Brady. Where's Greg Brady? Oh, there right you are. There. Yeah, that was how like a Tom, convention how about thing. Tom, how, do you have Tom Brady? Nope. Nope. No, boo. I only have a famous scientist. What TV show Bill, was Billy he Joel's in? percussionist. Oh, my. <laughs> like there's one. Exactly. And then there's uh, little Ricky from I Love Lucy show. Oh, that was gonna be hey, Ricky. God, he must be sick of that song. But I photographed a lot of people. These are photographs I took over the years. Colin, Billy, you two. You too. Billy's, Billy's trumpet player. <laughs> Clarence Clemens. Billy's horn section. Another saxophone player. It's hard to, hard to come by. Can't get that smaller. You don't miss any concerts, do you? Not many. I'm going Friday to New York City. What are you going to see? Billy. Oh, well, I'll stay back know. at Ma Madison Square Garden. Yeah. Billy? Just, Billy who? The Billy only famous Joel. people I know are you all. And I've got lots of great pictures with you all. So can I show you? I walked past my son's bedroom. And can I uh -oh, show you? Wait, I, I don't know. Should we see this? <laughs> Do we stop recording first, Brandy? No. <laughs> This is what I see. Oh, my <laughs> Lord. That's awesome. What an interesting kid. Uh, that looks a little like um, He's Kyle not Polish playing the gas uh, later, is he? Is he? What's that, that? I said he's not planning on gassing you later, is he? I don't know. Just, uh, I don't know. Because, <laughs> well, they both, my, both my kids have gas masks now for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> All the kids are doing better it. than having gas. Yeah. It's All the rage. New thing. Well, Mark has a straight costume. jacket. Maybe they think it's cooler than having a mask. Yeah. Maybe. Gas masks are cool. Paper <laughs> masks are lame, apparently. Yeah. People. Who needs people? People who needs people. Ugh. 
I knew once I heard the answers, I was just going to be super mad at myself on, I can't believe we missed three and four. <clears throat> well, the last one was so horrible. Yeah, I'm the serious. last one that was bad. four? Who wrote yeah. that? You know, that last My brain wasn't actually, working right. I actually knew that song. And for some reason, I had some lyrics stuck in my head of a newer song that ha was about um, voices in your head saying, to kill somebody kill yourself why don't you just kill yourself but i knew that song that that the answer actually was so they had a lot of other ones to choose from i almost went with baby got back and i was like no nah, that's just too stupid baby come back baby no baby no baby got back <laughs> was that a rap yeah. song about i like big I, butts and i don't I know cannot why. lie yeah. oh that one that one yeah that's on the list there's a list at the bottom of the answers that has all the true one hit wonders because there was other songs that are close like the knack had my sharona but they oh, had another that? hit right. what so was that the wasn't source? a one hit wonder what was your source kevin it's uh it's, it's a list it's there at the bottom of the list In the answers medium yeah it's some guy who works at billboard or something search the archives but it was only good until like 2002 or something like that it wasn't like it's, it's kind of old so there might be some since then so, so in other words, if Dexy's Midnight Runners had another hit in 2015, that would have thrown the whole thing off. Yeah, that's true, but I don't think I don't think they did. I, I don't think so. Like, does anybody know the other hit that uh, the Knack had? Yeah, my Sharona was number one for like six weeks, but they had a number eleven hit. They were only that, um, six weeks. That thing was on forever. Well, the album was, but the Aisha. song was a six weeks at number one. It was a Good Girls Don't. But I do. That's the song, Good Girls Don't, But I Do. That was by The Knack. Yeah, that's what wow. I meant. That's what I meant, the lyric of the song. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. That was an announcement, Karen. Karen. Way to cover yourself there. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, are we at five minutes? We're at five minutes, aren't we? A little bit. Close enough. All right, Carl. Carl with the K, so you say. Carl with a K with a say, so they say. So they say, Carl with a K. Who's they? They say. Who are they? they? Carl's with a K, but no only way. they say. No way. Oi, they. Oi, they. <laughs> So you say, just, please just save us from this, Carl. <laughs> Carl. Hurry, the Carl. Case, Hurry. So they I'll, say, I'll, I'll tell hey, everyone hey, your hey. real last name. Have you given Thumbs me godlike powers? Yes, a long okay. time ago. <laughs> okay. Carl with a K. Let's click your heels together three times. Oh, so this category oh. is scary movies by bad descriptions. <laughs> oh, this should be fun. Okay. okay. All right. Oh, that sounds fun. Scary according to who? Just scary. So who's in charge of muting everyone? Oh, um, Adrian says she'll be right back. So let me see. I have to go to participants. Mute all. Don't forget to unmute yourself, Carl, with the K. So you say. Uh -huh. Oh, did it do it? Yeah, I guess I did it. Oh, that's cool. It doesn't unmute me. I was wondering. Okay, I that's interesting. I think I still have powers, Susan. <gasps> All right. Number one. Buxom Coastal DJ reports on an unusual ground level weather condition. Long lost travelers return to a town that intentionally gave them bad directions for compensation. <laughs> I love that description. Number two, a bunch of people on a spaceship don't listen to a smart woman. In the end, everybody but the smart woman and her cat dies. Good, good advice to live by. Number three, disfigured boiler room worker teaches high school students to believe in their dreams. <laughs> Number four, three drunks illegally kill a vulnerable endangered aquatic species and sink their boat in the process.
Number five, teenage girl gets sick and becomes bedridden. Desperate mom gets help from two religious extremists after the daughter starts throwing up. Also, I think her thermostat is broken. <laughs> Number six, <laughs> the benefit of having sex in the projection room is that you get to survive the apocalypse. Number seven, some people get lost in the woods and due to bad camera work, they accidentally inspire a new film genre. Ooh. Number eight, a black man keeps a group of white people in an old farmhouse by boarding up the house and killing anyone that tries to get in. Number nine, Animal rights activists destroy civilization in less than two fortnights. And finally, number 10, small undead Ute kills Herman Munster. My apologies Excellent, to Wilma Smithers. who has no movie experience. Excellent Smithers. <laughs> she's going to get a very long list of things she's going to have to watch over the over the months she's been playing with this. She probably has this she's huge doing. thing of people like, oh, you got to get this and oh, yeah, and this. The These Wait. are awesome, Carl. All right, good job, Carl. Okay, everybody, so ready to go? Ready. Yeah. All right, here we go. Lot. I also think they are completely puzzling. So. Oh dear. Uh, Number one is The Fog with Adrian Barbeau. Oh, okay. Woo. That's I, a movie that I haven't seen. So yeah. He was one of my customers when I worked in Carmel. I love that movie when it came out. It was it was scary at the time. And so, she was gorgeous. So number two is yeah. Aliens. Oh, Alien. Yeah. Three is Nightmare on Elm Street. Yeah. Ooh. Four is Jaws. You already Jaws. got that. Five is The Exorcist. Yeah, wasn't that great? What was it about the the heating? She needed to have heat. I don't know. I, I I didn't get that clue. I'm sure I've seen it, but I don't know what six is. We'll come back. Let's come back to it. Yeah. The Blair Witch Project. Right. Yeah. Now is that right. Night of the Living Dead? Night of the Living Dead. Eight. Night yeah, definitely. Dead. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Number nine is 28 Days Later. I Thank you. Them. So six and ten, huh? Yeah. The thing with ten is that he gave clues like um, undead youth, it's supposed to be a youth, and that's what uh, what's his face? Um, my cousin Vinny yeah. said youths, and then the actor who played Herman Munster played the judge in that. Oh yeah, he did. And so I'm wondering if it's like Pet Cemetery. Oh yeah. Because he was also in Pet Cemetery. That's abstract. Yeah, but what does Herman Munster have to do with it? Was the actor who uh got I can't even think of his name right now. He was also in Pet Cemetery. Oh, okay, great. That makes sense. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, number six. Somebody read it out loud. Let's see if it, it triggers something. The benefit of having sex in the projection room is that you get to survive the apocalypse. So was there some uh, horror movie where just playing the film, uh, like monsters came out of the film when they were playing it in a movie theater? Doesn't ring a bell to me. Well, this is not a horror film, but that's similar to what happened into Inglorious Bastards, I thought, because the the entire Nazi hiking man was killed in that theater. Oh, the projection room. Where I think the people in the projection room, but it's not a horror film, but that's the only thing I could think of that involves a projection room. Yeah, it's also not the apocalypse, right? 
So zo- yeah, it's not the apocalypse. Zombies? Are there zombies? Is there a zombie yeah. movie that takes place in a film theater? Hmm. Um, what happened in uh, what was that planet Planet Z or what? No, that wasn't in that one. Never mind. Uh, the Blob? No, the Blob comes out well, of a movie, movie theater, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, didn't it? Didn't it? That that would be oh. a, that would be a good. Yeah. But it's not really apocalypse either. But no. I guess it was just the yeah. Hmm. No idea. The apocalypse is like maybe we should ask for clarification about the apocalypse. He's here. He's trying to put his hand in his mouth so we won't be able. To- well, the apocalypse <laughs> is the apocalypse. It's you know the end of life as we know it on planet Earth, yeah, right? It, yeah. end, it, general end to most living people, end of civilization, etc. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, Omega Man. So it's not just the destruction of one town; it's the entire planet's in danger. Did it's Omega Man? Thing have a sex scene in a projection room <laughs> there's a sequence in mean girls about trying to catch someone having sex in the projector room above the gymnasium Ooh, mean girls I, I don't think but that's not an apocalypse movie <laughs> no that's right i mean <laughs> sure no Someone didn't get elected prom queen. No, that doesn't count. Okay. Someone not getting elected prom queen can be the end to life as they know it. Yes, that's true. Okay, that's fair, I guess. <laughs> but I, I generally think, think apocalypse. apocalypse means... I'm adding it to my list. I gotta watch that. The human race, oh. not just one person. You know. Oh, man, I'm never gonna get anything done. Hmm. Hmm. So no you know idea. what you can do, Susan, to to speed through your list of things to watch. If it's a film, just pick like four random points and fast forward to those points <laughs> and see if it's worth watching the whole thing. Just enough to get the gist of it, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I need to sit down and do that kind of thing one day. Every day, I tell myself, "Today, I'm going to watch whatever on my list." But then I always say. As soon as I finish this other task, and I never, I'll well, finish that task, but then I'll go to the next task. You know why the six can't be the blob? Because they wouldn't have had people having sex. No, it would be That's alluded true. to maybe. It's a, a more modern kind of disappearance. It's, it's got to be more modern. Yeah, my problem is that I don't like. I'm not calling anything to mind for sure, but I'm also not a huge like horror film or thriller film person. Yeah, and I asked my husband, he likes to watch those types of movies. He can't come up with anything for number six either. Wow, that's amazing that we don't yeah. have that. Let's see. Yeah. He, and he watches them all the time. In fact, him and my young, middle boy used to, mm-hmm. every Saturday night, watch as many scary, awful movies as he could. Oh, what about that one? What's the one with the, um, the swirly woman alien? It's campy. Um, Mars Attacks? Is there a scene in Mars Attacks like that? Oh, that's a good choice, but I don't think so. No. The the woman who survives is in a, a old folks home playing. <laughs> that was a, that was an amazing movie, you guys. I gotta watch it again. I was oh, pretty, that is so good. I was pretty high. We oh. went <laughs> well. Like, what's so interesting is we went to the sci fi museum. Like Susan was there. I was and there. that's where I first learned that Mars Attacks is an allegory about colonization. Oh, I don't remember it, that being an, it mentioned. No, it is. It's Earth getting colonized by Mars. It's like Western colonization. Mm. Like if we don't speak their language, they don't try to attack, they don't attempt to understand us and they just kill us on site because, you know, it's convenient. And the music? Well, I mean, obviously all the music is, you know, is is made, but it's like the idea is that it's supposed to be this, you know, it's supposed to be a tale of getting colon what it's like to be colonized. So oh, that was a good film. That was such a good film. Yeah. Um, no idea. But yeah, sex in the projection room. Hmm. No idea. It's not it's not something like I am legend or something, right? 
because I didn't see that film. No, that's about people dying from uh, cancer, a cancer oh. cure that turns everybody into zombies. So uh, can we think of a horror film that nobody here has seen, but we know of, and that might be the answer, since we mm -hmm. obviously don't know the plot. <laughs> There's a lot I haven't seen. Like, what about the Independence Day series? I don't know. I didn't see that. I the seen Independence them Day? Oh, I have uh, seen it, but it's years ago. I don't think it exists in the same... The rest yeah. of these definitely have, like, a terror element to them mm -hmm. that... Independence Day never really had that. Correct, yeah. It was an action film. I'm getting, well, it doesn't matter if I'm getting a feeling, but for some reason I keep going back to kind of a science fiction comedy. Da, da, da. Could be. Horror comedies. It does kind of sound like that, doesn't it, Karen? Yeah. But Have I you guys seen The Lost Skeleton of Cadaver? No. Do you want to guess that? <laughs> it is a fucking amazing film. I'm going to show it someday at my house. So I'll, I'll invite you over. It's okay, one of the best sci fi films ever. Yeah. And you can't look it up because if you do, it'll spoil it. Caspian's seen it. And he's spoiled? Yeah, no, not really. He's not. Okay, he's not. He just no, got I can't last one, huh? Right answer. answer. Yeah, we're just, we're just stuck on number six. So. So if other people are, are getting there, I'm I'm getting yeah. close to pulling the trigger on the timer. Yeah, that's yeah. We don't. Well, I don't know if we're gonna get six. I don't. I don't know. Yeah, like I don't know that any amount of deliberation will really get it unless one of us has an epiphany. How about Wizard of Oz? That's evil, terrifying. Evil Dead. I don't know. Nothing. Night of the Evil Dead. No, there's the the, <laughs> the Legend of the Cat Woman. Army of Darkness. Okay, uh, Army of the Darkness. Yoga Masters. <laughs> the Jello Eater. The Cavern of Caverns. Nazis on the Moon. Nazis on the Moon, yeah. <laughs> that's, it, that's it. Nazis on the Moon. Okay, that's great. Moon. That's right. Well, the official movie is Iron Sky of that movie. <laughs> okay. Real movie. It's a funny movie. Oh, you're Iron supposed to not Sky. be in the room when you do the countdown because now when you leave the room, it's going gonna, it's gonna... to. I haven't started it yet. Yeah, you have. No, oh, I said oh, the no, okay. thing. No, no. He counts out the go out, out, go out and then pull us back. Yeah, yeah. Well, how do I go out? Hey, oh, leave, room. Just... leave room. Oh, yeah, leave room. Okay. Leave the room. The conventional way. Leave, leave the room. Oh, see, he did. That's amazing. <laughs> yep. Karen, yeah, are you guys going to hand out candy get this week? Six. I mean, I'm sure six is going to be like, oh, yeah, we totally knew that one. But yeah, it also could be like, yes, yes, we are. Yes, we give candy. I'm trying to get some of the other neighbors to do it this this time because it was skipped last year and I want to put lights out. I think we're going to sit at the end of the driveway, put a table and put Christmas lights. That could be Halloween, I guess. And I'll yeah. and we'll hand out candy. I think it's we have purple. Do. We have purple and white lights in front and we're going to give can and we have marigolds yeah. on the porch. We're going to give candy. Last yeah. year, people came up with the most creative solutions to deliver candy to children from a distance. Mm -hmm. Oh, they threw like it out? Candy zip lines. Yeah. And like all tubes kind of tubes yeah. tubes like it was amazing what people came up with just so like there could be a hands-free halloween oh, experience. yeah last yeah. year we um when they started walking down the path we just opened the door we put it out on the table and stepped back and they came up and we didn't do candy last year gobrick is the host now yes stop that chair there uh, hey, that was an answer from my trivia on Thursday. Word to your mother. Saturday. And Susan, ice, ice baby. Yeah, word to your mother. That was that was the vanilla ice version of uh, play that funky music. Oh, what, Karen? Susan, we use tongs for the candy. We dump the candy <laughs> into aluminum tubs, and we use tongs, and we just put it like on a little wooden table on the porch when they started walking up the uh, the the uh, path. And just stayed away from them. Yeah, we're gonna. We're Karen and I live on the same street, so we're talking about. I I want to get my neighbors to all do candy this year, or most of them, so that we have something. Cass, why don't you come over and hand out candy with us? No. <laughs> well, no, it's not. You should you should hand out the candy with a slingshot. Oh, no. <laughs> make them or open their mouth. The Make the kids just go, ah, uh, ah. Uh, uh, I have a trebuchet. I'll, I'll hand out candy did have from a trebuchet. my left hand to my right hand. 
<laughs> Caspian had a trebuchet. My cell phone. We, we built trebuchets out of old fences. What is that? What are you talking about? It's a, it's a catapult. It's catapult. a it's a fun time, uh, a fun thing to go down the rabbit hole. It's how it's you get a gravity cow. powered catapult. It's how you get a cow from one place to another. In the Holy Grail. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And North, Northern Exposure too. Okay, here we go. Okay, so this this was a lot. Of, this is a lot of fun to write these. I had enough to do a whole nother round. Oh, that was fun. This nope. was most fun, Carl. Most fun. Uh, I don't know if anyone got ten. They might have, but I know there. I don't think there's any question that someone didn't know the answer to. Number one. We got, we got the one. Number Rocky one. Laura. The fog. Yeah. Uh, it's never not, seen it before. It's not Rocky Horror. No. no. It was the no. fog starring Adrian Barbeau. Yeah, uh, somehow I knew it was a horror movie and Jamie Lee Curtis. Number two, Alien. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Not Aliens, Alien. Singular Alien. Alien. Number three, A Nightmare on Elm Street. Yeah. Cass, mm -hmm. are you eating Halloween candy now? No, this is shredded romaine lettuce. Sure. Number four was Jaws. The alternate description for that was Beach Town Mayor addresses boating accident and inadvertently sets model for Republican response to future COVID-19 pandemic. <laughs> 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 uh, I have good. got to put that in. Oh, that's, oh, good. that's, that's <laughs> lovely. That's good. Nothing to see here. No problem. Go back in the water. Number five is The Exorcist. Mm -hmm. Yay. I know at least one group, if not more than one, got Night of the Comet. Oh, I knew you weren't going to get that one right. Oh, I never heard of that. They're the blob works for that too, wait, though. Wait, Carl, tell us about Night of the Comet. It's a really bad movie. Oh, it's a great. Oh, it's movie. actually no, it's good. It's, it's a great movie. A, a comet passes by and leaves dust that kill most of the world that's out and unprotected. A few yeah. adults survive and kind of get turned into zombies. A girl survives because she had sex with her boyfriend in the projection room. Her sister <laughs> survives because she got locked out of the house and slept in the metal shed overnight. Yeah, so how would the blob fit that? Which and I don't think it does. What happened to the boy? Kevin. Because the blob came he out of the movie theater. got killed as soon as he went outside and got oh. attacked by the zombies. You know what, Rob? boys never matter in this scenario. Yeah. Rob, Rob, at some point we said the blob as well because the blob came out of a movie theater. But then we yeah. thought yeah. that there wouldn't have been sex there in those days. Right, mm. that's the only thing. Yeah, Seven, so the Blair Witch. So, yeah. Remember, yeah. so it, it yeah. Yeah. For all the details except for where it doesn't. Does anyone remember who the star of the original Blob movie was? Paul. Uh, no. Steve McQueen. Steve McQueen, Steve McQueen, right? McQueen yeah. And say. not not the current director, but the. It was before he was famous. Yeah, that Seven was, like was Blair Witch. Eight is Night of the Living Dead. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Number nine is Two Fortnights Later. I mean, 28 Days Later. Mm -hmm. And 10 was Pet Cemetery. Wow. Nine, hey, Paula. 928 Days Later? Hi, Glenn. That was the guy I yeah. can remember. Because he was both in Cousin Vinny and then Pet Cemetery. But, but the thing was like the youth. Yeah. That was the clue. Paul right. got it. Hey team, I didn't know nine, but someone else said I think something close to that, but not that. Am I wrong? What did yeah, we, we say? Got for it, nine? That we got that one. Okay. I, I put you in there so people didn't ins insist that no, you said it was a Herman Munster movie. Good job. It's two different all right. So let's see oh, here. Oh, let's start with what's the matter meta with Facebook? What's the matter with Facebook? Eight. Okay, let's go with uh, Aurora boring your boring us. Ten. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, they're oh, not. All, right. the All right, sidewalk wrestling wizards. Nine. Oh, Ooh, you, nine. Lost the, you lost the lead there. All right, what's the matter with Zeka? What's the matter with Zeka? Seven. Ooh, ow! Ouch. Okay, they were in the lead. Let's see if Halloween Eve, 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 Kevin got it. Sarah, nine. nine. <laughs> They're still in the lead by two. Dun 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 dun. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
that's pretty good because that was uh, um, Carl's team. And you know how clever, that goes. Carl, clever. Good job, Carl. That was fun. Carl with a K, so they say. Um, hey, hey. <laughs> Carl, so they say with a K. Every okay. day. Every day. Mm -hmm. So they say. And if anybody cares or is interested in the chat, there is a Word document containing this round. Ah, thank you. Okay, so now we've got Rob Palmer, which is scary, spooky things behind him. So I don't know what it's going to be about, but I don't think it's going to be happy. <laughs> so, oh, you got to get a deeper voice. People may have realized, uh, I remember that I did a, a category before, which was called Two Magic Ladies. And they played off two shows which played against each other on TV. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, this is a similar situation, except it's shows fitting the occasion. Oh, the nice. Munsters versus the Adams family? That is correct. Oh, We're calling this two, frighten, two frightening families, the Munsters versus the Adams family. Didn't we do this one already? Not we had a knowledge. category. I did a category a long time ago that had some of the Munsters and some of yeah. the Adams yeah. family. I didn't remember that. Hopefully, it's Somewhere. not some of the But it wasn't questions. versus, I think it was. There was a question about which one came first or something. Yeah. It was like, um, I don't know. I don't even remember. It wouldn't yeah. help me any. So I don't remember. All right. So I'm going to mute. Put uh, it in the chat, Robert. Three, two, okay. one. Okay. So, well, if we did this before, I did not see that in the list. Um, I might have Googled the wrong series of words. So I don't think we did it before. Okay, I don't know. I think we've had some of the some kind of questions. Like all right. So Alex if Alex. if we did, what you said was exactly question number one. Which series had the earliest starting year, or did they start in the same season? Or... Question number two. How many seasons did the two series run collectively? Ooh. Plus or minus? Nope. Evil, Rob, evil. Yeah, it's Halloween season, what do you want? Question number three. Which series ran more episodes in color or did they both have the same number? So that's like just one out of three choices, okay? so. And also, very easy because it's a 50 50 shot. Which series achieved higher Nielsen's ratings? So, a lot of these are sort of not, they are limited answer sets. Number five, which US network was the Munsters on? Again, because of the time frame, not many possible answers. Number six, are you trying to say this is going to be easy? Which US network was the Adams family on? Number seven. Okay, so that's the end of the really uh, like easy selection ones. Question number seven. The Adams Family sitcom was based on unnamed characters which appeared in a cartoon strip by Charles Adams. Name the magazine in which that strip first appeared. Question number eight. This one's a number. The, Munster lived, the Munsters lived in the fictional city of Mockingbird Heights on Mockingbird Lane. But what was their house number? No plus or minus on that. It's got to be exact. Question 19. 19? Question 99. The Adams family's memorable theme was dominated by two instruments with finger snaps added as percussive accompaniment. Name either instrument. And I'm, I'm giving you the link where you can play the theme. Don't, don't look at anything else. Don't even read the comments on the page because there's hundreds of them. Somebody might've said it. And then we'll give it away. What's that? That will give it, if listening to it, we'll give it away. Well, it would for some people. I don't have a clue. So, yeah, if you have people who are musically oriented, it would. For me, I wouldn't know. Alan. Number 10. The beautiful Marilyn Munster is the odd one out in the Munster clan. 
to whom is she a blood relation? And that's it. Ooh, these bring back memories. Okay. Sinister rooms, Robert. Any questions? Pretty straightforward. Okay. Breakout rooms, open all rooms. Good luck. Mark? Well, number one was the question we had before. So who remembers the answer? No idea. Mark is an expert on these things. I told him if we don't get something, I'll ask him. Yeah. I think it was him. Get him Does in anybody here. know these? Jamie said see you think it's the Adams? Adams? No. I think the Adams family was first. Okay. okay. Which year had things? the earliest starting year? Munsters or the Adams family? Adam family. Adam's family, so I'm one. How many seasons did the two series run collectively? I don't know. Which series had more episodes in color or did they have the same number? Monsters had more color. I, okay. No, the Monsters was all black and white, though. Mm, not that. Okay, was number it? four. What series achieved higher Nielsen ratings? Adam family, I think. Which network was the Munsters on? And what network was the Adams Family on? Oh, God. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I can't answer that. I don't remember. ABC, CBS. Oh, oh here, here's Charles Adams. Which Adams Family sitcom? Oh, he's brushing his teeth. The magazine was The New Yorker, right? Yeah, I think so. The Adams Family was based on a cartoon strip by Charles Adams. What magazine was it in, Mark? The New Yorker. The New Yorker, okay. And they yeah. were at 1313 Mockingbird Lane. Yeah, 1313. That was the Monsters. And the Adams Family memorable theme was dominated by two instruments with finger snaps added as percussion accompaniment. Name either instrument. Harpsichord and... Uh... We just need one of them, right, though? Harpsichord. And the last question is, the beautiful Marilyn Munster is odd one out in the Munster clan. To whom is she a blood relation? Isn't it Herman? Yeah, because he's like all different parts. So one of the parts could be her. I don't remember that. Sorry. I thought that she was his niece. Yeah. Plus, I mean... Well, her Here's last the name thing. Munster. I think <laughs> Grandpa Munster was Lily Munster's father. So if she was a blood relation to either of them, it would be both of them. Thanks, Mark. Although I'm pretty sure he should be a, Eddie should, Eddie should count too because she would be a blood because if Eddie is the child of Herman and Lily, then they're all sort of blood relation to each other. But I would say Herman. Yeah, especially since the last name is Munster. I mean. She wouldn't have seen. But in which case, she should also be a blood relation to Eddie, but. Was it Eddie adopted? Was he? I don't know. I guess maybe. I then know. it definitely should be Herman. So which ones do we not have? Let's go back. To the, who's uh, who's who's writing down all our answers? Not me. All right, all right. So one, we said the Adams family came first. Two, one right after the other, I think. Yeah. Like four. Let's four each. Eight. Oh, collectively? So you want eight? Probably more, but I don't think either of them ran in color at all. So then it'd be the same number, zero. I think the movie they made of the Munsters may have been in color, but I could be wrong on that. 
Can you can you ask Mark if he thinks that might be correct? If it's in color. I'm. Mark. He's. I don't know. He's doing something else now. Um, which series achieved higher Nielsen ratings? Let me ask him about the color. I'll go ask him. I need to stand up anyway. Hmm. I feel like the Adams family was always more popular. You think? So I would say the Munsters because it's it's weirdly more. I think the Adams family was more sort of uh, weird. Yeah, and so I think Mun it, the well, Munsters was more like campy, mainstreamy. And nobody has any idea what network they were on. Mark says he thinks that the Munsters were on uh, in color, but he doesn't ever remember the Adams family being in color. And there's only CBS, NBC, and ABC. So let's say CBS for the Munsters and ABC for the Adams family. I don't know. But not the oh, three network. networks. You guys figure that out. <laughs> Good answer. Wait. <laughs> not answer. Wait, what did I say? CBS Munster, ABC Adams. He thinks that the Munsters, that the Adams family's that, first, right? I don't so. think that that's right, though. Can I switch the Adams family to. Uh, I don't care. I don't right. know the answer to any of these, I don't think. <laughs> I mean, the Adams family's first, which means maybe that would be CBS. I don't choose NBC for the monster. I do know it's 1313. That made total sense as soon as you said it. Yeah. What did we have for four? Adam's family. All right. Hello, Hamilton. So hello, everybody. Hello, Hamilton. It's Paul. All right. 1313, The New Yorker. What did we say? We Harpsichord? Yeah. That's like Mark said, oh, I want to hear the music. Oh, yeah, let's play it. The Adams family members and... dominate two instruments. Don't sit on that. All right, so here's what I have for our answers. For the earliest one, Adams family, total number of seasons, eight. Um, three, which one more episodes? We're, okay, we'll put, we'll put monsters for most more in color. Four, uh, Adams Family. Five for the Munsters is NBC. Six for the Adams Family, CBS. Seven, The New Yorker. Eight, 1313. Nine, Harpsichord. And 10, Herman Munster. Any, anyone wants to change any of those? I'm not married to any of those. <laughs> It is harpsichord, isn't it? I think we're good. That doesn't sound like a harpsichord to me. No, no, you got a better guess. Sounds like a harpsichord, but no. I sounds like harpsichord. Yeah. I don't know what the other the one. opening notes that didn't sound that way. Mm. Let's get whatever the mystery other. I just realized I could be watching that new Star Trek show on Paramount Plus right now. I haven't even seen the old ones. Caspian has to come over and bring something here and say, you're sitting down and watching this. This is the only way I see anything, right, Cass? That's not true. Pretty it's close. The only things you see are obscure television shows. No, I don't haven't watched hardly anything in a long time. Have you seen, have you seen uh, Dune yet? No. Yeah. 
It was fine. I like the 1984 Dune better. Uh, I, I, I probably gonna have to go see it or watch it on TV or something. Okay. You guys look puzzled. Everybody all right? We're puzzled. I don't know. Yeah, I think we're great. I mean, I read them off. I don't have any. Uh... James is having trouble. I keep, he, he keeps coming in and out. It's amazing. See you in the big room. Bye, guys. Anderson. Craven. Anderson? Say again, Carl. Wes Anderson. Wes, Wes Anderson. Anderson. He takes his time. I really like uh, his yeah. style. He's he's a modern person who takes his time. His what the heck are you great. guys talking about over here? I'm not sure I want to know. I Tell have her. a friend who hates Wes Anderson. We're talking about having sex in a projection room and avoiding the apocalypse. <gasps> With Wes Anderson, whoever that sure. is. Does your friend who hates Wes Anderson, Anderson also hates the American American French Dispatch? It's great. It's better than believing in Jesus, I guess. Jesus. 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 Gotta Jesus. find a friend in Jesus. Okay, we ready? <laughs> yeah. Oh. We ready? We ready? Okay. I hope you didn't screw your team. I, uh, I hope so too. It happens almost every time. Okay, so which series had the earliest starting date, or did they start in the same season? It turns out it was the same season. Yeah. 1964, okay. if anyone cares. I heard someone actually knew that. That was surprising. Paula. Are you good? Uh, how many seasons did it, uh, the two series run collectively for? Uh, and they also both ran for the same number of seasons, which was two, so the answer is four. Oh, no. All That's right. all? Really? That's all. Yep. Right. Number, number three, which series ran which series ran more episodes in color or did they both have the same number? Slightly trick question, because as I heard some people figure out, none of them were in uh, color. The answer is the I same. I told you, Susan. I said it. No, I you, said, no, I did, but we asked Mark. You made me write color. The monsters. <laughs> So the thing that might be, uh, you know, uh, tricking people's memories is both of them had follow-up things uh, much later, which were done in color. The monsters so. had a mo movie in color. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, which series achieved higher Nielsen ratings? Surprisingly, I heard everyone saying the wrong thing. It's the monsters. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey. I told you that was the only one. I had right. My team overruled me. <clears throat> God, Mike is having a day. I'm being crazy. Okay. <laughs> Albert, he's like, we're out to give Mike. Like I'd like there. to feed for my team. <gasps> We've given out wrong answers then, Susan, and then it won't be a problem. <laughs> the mountain behind Mike is going to explode. Okay, which of the, <laughs> which of the networks in the U.S. Uh, had the monsters on? It was CBS. Yay. Yes. And the Adams it? Family oh. was on ABC. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Damn it. Yeah. Team. Did you get that right, Mike? Because I know you were. No, I had, the, I had it right and then I changed it. So See? I didn't have anything to do with that. That's your fault. No, no one yeah, had, Karen, you. Then Karen no one had an answer for that. So that does, does anybody know if if like Genie and Bewitched they ran at the same time as competitors? I couldn't find that information. No. Bewitched, Bewitched and I dream of Genie the were. The 50s were full of interesting oddball sitcoms. It was great. Mm. Okay, number seven. Uh, the answer to that, the magazine was, I heard many people say this right, The New Yorker. Yay. And interestingly, it was, as far as I could tell from what I read, only one panel. It wasn't like it was a cartoon in there all the time. And they were just odd characters that somebody had gone to their house. Hmm. And as I did hear some people say correctly, but other people didn't quite get it right, it's 1313 Mockingbird Lane. Oh, oh yeah. Fudge. I knew that one. Yep. That used to be the address of, I think that's the address of Disneyland too, 1313 Harbor Boulevard. Uh, that's how I remember. <laughs> and the uh, theme was dominated by two musical instruments. I heard some people saying the right thing after playing it. It's the harpsichord and the bass clarinet. Well done, team. Oh, clarinet. Okay. Got both. And lastly, I think I saw somebody get this wrong. Uh, Marilyn is Lily's niece. Oh, 
Oh, shoot. I thought it was Herman's niece. Nope. No. no. So, yeah. Which she, part she's, of Herman? She's the, yeah, that's right. <laughs> so, so Marilyn is the daughter of Lily's sister. And, and you know, that's the part of the family that had the bad genes. Because... Well, wouldn't she also be a blood relative to Eddie? Wasn't Eddie, wasn't Eddie the, uh, not that that was what our answer was. It would be but... Eddie's cousin. But he's, he's descended from both, so he's not on one side. Yeah, he's uh, Eddie just the child of Lillian. Did, did you put Eddie? If you put Eddie, I'd give it to you. No, Eddie's like, cousin. No. Oh. Cousin Eddie is from No, we, we Lily's we niece is not Eddie. Eddie. But definitely I'm not not her. Uh, definitely not Herman, and, and also not not the vampire uh, grandfather. Grandpa. Yeah, no. Except that it wasn't the grandpa Lily's father. No, that doesn't make any sense. He's a vampire. She's not. So I don't think so. <laughs> Wait, is she a vampire? <laughs> token. Let's get it makes so much more sense that he's the <laughs> other way. That's right. No. <laughs> no. Good job. It's always it's always important to use legitimate genetic knowledge when <laughs> analyzing <laughs> the uh, monsters. When, when, when analyzing monster shows on TV. It was funny that the last question in the round before was a monster question too. So according according to Wikipedia, Grandpa is Lily's father. Right. Yeah. Which means. Okay, I didn't catch that. If you put that down, that's true too. The only one that's actually absolutely wrong is that. So so apparently, being a vampire is recessive. Can you put (laughs) those questions and the answers in the chat? Assumed because because she they were her uncle and aunt, you know. But you, we were assuming that, but it makes sense. Grandpa, Eddie, all of them. He's blood related on one side and related by. She has blood. No, she was a normal human as far as it was ever recorded. <clears throat> okay, so we have now we have to see if we broke it up this a little bit further or if we've gotten closer together. So let's go with the number one in the last place. What's the meta with Facebook? Eight. And let's go. What's a meta with Zaka? Please post eight. the answers. Eight? Yep, eight. eight. Yep. All right, they stayed in there. Okay, sidewalk wrestling wizards. You're being targeted. <laughs> I'm going to say seven, team. Does anybody disagree? You're in the lead. Well, no, almost in the lead. Thank no, you. we won't be. <clears throat> Halloween. No, no, no. Aurora Bor. Boobas. <laughs> three. Hey, boo, boo. Did you say three? Uh, yes, you killed us, Susan. Wait. Oh, that's awful. Oh, my God. What did you do, Susan? <laughs> oh, it's safe to blame oh, I don't know any of the answers. Hey, Susan, you aren't you supposed to, Susan, aren't you supposed oh. to be keeping track of your score in the bottom line? No. Oh, yeah. Hey, oh, Mark, my Mark God. got harpsichord. Just, just letting you know. Okay, Halloween Eve, 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 Kevin. Ten. Ten. Oh. Whoa. Damn. Damn. Work Halloween Eve, Eve. Oh, ahead. Wow. Yeah. Look at that. Insurmountable lead. Thanks, okay. Susan. Yeah, we need we need mono rules for the last round. Mono rules for the last one. Mono, mono rules. Mono rules. Mono rules. Not mono okay. rules. Mono rules. Okay. Right. I mean, does, does anyone does anyone recognize the mountain behind me? I was wondering what that is. is that Rainier? No, it's not Rainier. That's no the no. double peaks. Shasta, the Matterhorn. No. Mongong. Yeah. Thank, thank you. got it. Mongong. It's a, it's it's, a, it's in honor of our new newest person to join Shasta. us. Oh Shasta. Oh, Shasta. Oh. Oh. Shasta say hi. Oh, look, it's not Shasta in honor of you, Shasta. There's also See, a song. I mean, who else would welcome you in that same way? No, I mean, like, look, we have a dorm across from us named Shasta, and actually people from Shasta were screaming, fuck Lassen, because we're in Lassen Hall. There's also a mountain named after you. There's a school named after you. Like, she's like, Minnesota. Yeah, you guys just missed it. We were, while we were, was, fuck, fuck Lassen, fuck Shasta. People were screaming back and forth at each other. It's a great day to be in college. Oh, how fun. <laughs> they are so clever. I know, <laughs> right? Oh, so smart. Smart. Every day is a so great day smart. to be in college. Managed to bet what I had of popcorn and set off the fire alarm at 18 years old. Yeah, like <laughs> multiple yeah. times. It's horrible stuff. <laughs> what are you showing us, Alan? Is that weather? What is it? Can't tell. 
I don't Ellen, know you're saying. muted. We can't hear Unmute, you. Unmute, Ellen. Unmute. Unmute and share verbally, please. <laughs> Use your words. <laughs> okay. Interpretive dance, uh, Ellen. Okay. Okay. Hang on. Here. What did you say? So, so I, I love images that every time you rotate it, it goes. Oh, the the it. <laughs> oh now he broke his phone. <laughs> Well, now hold on. Your glasses ask, are on your head now. No, no, no. Dropped it in the beer. Ask Wilma what this is. Well, it's a phone that we can't see. <laughs> it's swirly lines. It's pretty. It's it's marble. Is that the big is, and the rotating East Coast? doesn't help. No, this is, on, is, this is this is this is, is uh, Wilma art. Oh, well, that's oh, what Wilma I was going to say. But oh, that I, that I didn't hey. know. What are you what are you talking about? I painted that earlier tonight. I saw oh. a paint on it. Oh. <laughs> like, I don't know why. <laughs> Thank you, Alan. Does Alan have it? <laughs> like, what is he talking about? How does Alan, I just Alan have your art? I'm it confused. Popped up, it popped up on Facebook right away here. So I was just uh, going to share it. Uh, oh, we thought it had something to do with Mount Shasta. We were doubly confused. Oh, very good. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so before we get, I forgot completely to go to bonuses. I mean, the bonuses to announcements. Kyle, you got something? A data skeptic. He's on. You got to go off mute to make any announcements. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So thanks everybody. This week on Data Skeptic, yet again more time series stuff. That's what we're doing right now. So if you're interested in predicting the future based on sequential historical data, Data Skeptic time series is for you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else that we need to know about? Skeptic Cal, you still can join at, if you want to pay 20 bucks. You can register and they will give you down a list of videos. It was tremendous fun, you guys. You've got to see Skepperty. That was so much fun. George Robb, myself, and Thomas Westbrook from Holy Kool Aid. And, and, and the, talks, the talks were really good too. Oh, yeah, they were really great. And I didn't have time this weekend, but I want to, I'm, I'm happy to pay $20. Yeah, 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 no, no, yeah no, it was great. Care to see Paul um, Offit. Paul Offit's talk Offit, was fantastic. It was and, amazing. And he blessed Kevin. He, gave, he told him, he told Kevin that he wins everything. So just that right there was worth the. And I won practice. socks too. And you want socks. <laughs> I want those socks. They're supposed to be mailing me some socks. They didn't ask there. me for uh, my address yet. So oh. I don't know how I'm going to get them. And you didn't come get <laughs> your, your dead possum. Me. Yeah, yeah, and there was a dead possum. And I got in the mail today um, a Swiss Army knife from Bill Patterson. And I, I guess I put it in my purse or something like that. But boy, Skepperty was a the Which whole model is it? The whole thing was wonderful. You know, it, so, so if you want to pay your twenty dollars, go to Skepti Cal Conference and go and watch the videos. The one on Alzheimer's by Rachel Dunlop. Oh my gosh, that was terrific and depressing as hell. Extremely <laughs> depressing. Yeah, but if you, but I felt like I learned so much from that. So, and the Sunday papers, they were great. They're loading right now. And then, anything else we should know about? Who spoke at the Sunday papers? Um. Craig Foster. Craig, Craig Foster talked. Uh, JD Score did Operation Onion Ring. Uh, Mark uh, Westbrook from uh, no, Northern he had, um, Mark West uh, New Newbrook. Yeah, Newbrook. Newbrook. Yeah, Newbrook. he 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 talked. Um, Chris Guest from the Melbourne Skeptics, and I had Allison Long from GSOW talked about her journey with um, vaccination misinformation using Wikipedia. And the and other stuff. It was terrific weekend. Oh my gosh, the That's whole thing. Through. Description, by the way. So check that out. Okay. Shasta wow. has a cola that's called California Dreaming. <laughs> oh, so so Susan, I uh, I have like a minute video to play. Just this, people might like this series. So I found a series on Netflix on the weekend, the day it dropped, accidentally. And I was hooked immediately. And then I talked to oh, actually Russ Dobler saw my post on Facebook and he said, why don't you write a review? So I just turned that in. So it's going to be in a APT comics any day. And this is, uh, I'll show you, this is the second half. I watched half. the first episode of it. All I right. watched the whole thing. So it's she, it's uh, ridiculously she, yeah. funny. Did you stop recording? Yeah. yeah stop. Oh my God. Okay, we're good. Okay, I'm all right. Okay, does anybody know any of these for sure? I was I get them all mixed up all the time. Okay, let's see. Okay, Lubinana hang on. is uh, Slovenia. 
Bratislava Brata, Brata used to be in Czechoslovakia, or actually used to be in Hungary. Shit, where the hell so is So the it? way these are formatted, Sofia is uh, from- Sofia's uh, Bulgaria. Bulgaria. Sofia's I've been Bulgaria. There. Give a talk there once. Okay, let's see. Belgrade is. Um, oh, I hate the way these. Uh, are I, Belgrade, I think, is Bulgaria. No, we just said Sofia was Bulgaria. Oh, you're right. You're right. Damn it. Bulgaria. Belgrade. Belgrade. Damn. Oh. Okay. okay sorry. So Which one did you say, uh, Susan? Lubricana is Slovenia. I know that because we're from there. And, and Sofia is Bulgaria. Okay. And Sarajevo is in. There's Toronto, Ontario. <laughs> Let me look. Okay, Croatia is. Um, Bob, you're muted. Hurts of, Hurts of Go. Herzegovina, isn't that um, every time? Bosnia and Herzegovina. Oh, there it's just the way they're formatted. Yeah, that's it makes it really hard to read it that way. Yeah, that, but that's the only one that messes it up. All the rest are, are fine. Um Belgrade, sorry, who where did we say Belgrade is? What do you think? Uh, you're gonna get it. Yeah. Hang on. Sophia, what do we say? Sophia was Bulgaria. Bulgaria. Belgrade, damn it. You gotta write these down because this is not gonna make any sense. I am writing it down, but- No, I mean, I got it because I can't see what we've done and what we haven't. Uh, Belgrade, I think is, is Serbia. Okay, let's go with that for now. If you don't get 10, you get eight. Zagreb. Yeah. Unless you say the same answer and know you'll get one wrong, but you might get the other one right. So you can get a nine. Bob, is, you know what? Is, is Sarajevo, Serbia, maybe? It's, uh, it's not. Um, I'm I trying to do a I list and I'm not, is. not having good luck doing a list. I don't know how to go to the next line without hitting enter. Well, I'm using, on, I'm just writing on paper. Okay. Yeah. Well, I am too, but I thought I'd put it in here. Yeah, I can't do it. Bosnia and Herzegovina is the name of the country. Right. Yeah. Yes. So that's why the line looks wrong. Okay. Sophia. Is Skopje not Croatia? Does that ring a bell to anybody? Oh, that's much oh. better. Where, Thank is you. Sarajevo, is Sarajevo where the Archduke Ferdinand was assassinated? Where was Sarajevo is, uh, that would be Austria, wouldn't it? Yeah, but that's all. It's, it, it was the Austrian uh, on, uh, uh, Empire, but that's all. Those Sarajevo were all changed. was in uh, Yugoslavia, wasn't was, it? Yeah, these were all. All these things were Yugoslavia at one time, and then they all got all, oh, all got broken up. So broken up. Uh, Bosnia and Herz. Oh, where we go. Put it back. That was handy. Deborah, you're also muted. Okay, yeah, that's handy. Yeah, leave that um, up. Okay, so let's see. I don't know how it got muted. Put, put what you know for go. sure. Let's do what okay. we know for sure. We okay, know. so what, which ones do we know for sure? I could type Lugana some. Lugana is for Sophia, sure. Slovenia. Sophia, Bulgaria. All right, so let me see here. Let me copy this and put Sophia right there. And then... Um, take out Bulgaria. And then take out Bulgaria. Mm, like that. Okay. And which other ones did you say? You said the, um, which was Slovenia? Is Ljubljana. Okay, right. Ljubljana, oh, the one up here. Okay. That one there? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then what other ones? We had Belgrade and Serbia. Serbia. Okay. Belgrade. Okay. Okay. 
This is good. So Croatia is. I, is Zagreb, Zagreb, Albania? No, I don't know. I don't know that one at all. Um, I mean, I know both names and the, a lot of the other ones are not familiar to me. But so I'm thinking maybe Zagreb and Albania. Sarajevo is so familiar. What country is that in? Yeah, no kidding. Uh, is it Bosnia Herzegovina? Oh, that's that's helpful. Okay, let's see. I I have a feeling that Sarajevo is in. I think I think it is Bosnia and Herzegovina. Yes, I would put that oh. one there. Okay, so that goes with where Sarajevo with Sarajevo. So, the, so Croatia is capital is. I think it's Skopje, but I'm I don't know. Croatia. I was thinking it might be Tirana, Tiria, but I'm not yeah. sure. Let me think. Okay, so this one that's C H I S I N A U, that is. Look at the spelling of that. That is like uh, from. Um, Mm, yeah. That's like from uh, Czech or something, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Isn't that Czech? Which one of these is a? Would that be Slovakia then? Maybe? Well, I think Bratislava was part of the Czech Republic at one, or was part of Czechoslovakia at one time. Which one? I think. Well, no, it doesn't matter. Bratislava. Well, Bratislava up here. But but look at that Chisnia. This that guy. is definitely like. It looks just like Czech. now. She's a now. Now. Yeah. Wait, which okay, where's where is Moldovia? I don't know where that is. Albania, Moldova. Moldova. Macedonia. This is cool. Um, <laughs> never even heard of it. I used to play a game like in a previous lifetime, matching capital cities with countries. Yeah, okay, go for it, Moldova. That was like freaking 15 years ago. Oh <laughs> did you ever have any of these countries? <laughs> actually, yeah. Really? Yeah, it was it was really difficult, actually. Yeah. Stop, Skopje is doesn't affect me. Yeah, just, just now. My would you try uh, 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 Sco um, wait, what do we say? Uh, what was with Moldova? Uh, which one? I'm just trying to think which ones even ring a bell. Uh, how yeah. about Tirana, Slovakia? Tirana, Slovakia. Again, I'm only doing. I'm only saying this because they're familiar. They're both. They're both familiar names. Yeah, that's make it worse. Um, <laughs> Makes it worse. But well, we can move them. <laughs> Zag Zagreb. Zagreb. Is that Croatia? Zagreb. Zagreb. Zagreb, Croatia. Does that sound right? Uh, if anyone okay. should know these, Susan, that's you because you're from that part of the world. I, I knew, I knew for sure Lubricana, and I for sure knew Sofia because I've been there. But Lubricana is where I think you might, from. Susan, you might be right. You might be right there. The Croatia, so, where where do you want to put it? Zagreb for Croatia. Zagreb from Croatia. So, you, so you're going to be that the person doesn't who seem, that doesn't feel right, right to me. Oh yeah, right. I'm not pronouncing. We'll put it there. We can move it. Zagreb, Croatia. Zagreb, Montenegro. Montenegro. I How swear about, that's Czech. Okay. Everyone, up, by the way, all the other rooms are done. Oh, fuck. No, it. Don't wow. well, you know like what? It. it took us a while to get it on this Word document. Otherwise, <laughs> we would have been done too. Let's go Look. North Macedonia with Skopje then. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay. They Which had a famous was... uh, monkey trial there in Skopje. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. um, Albania. Which none of these sound like they're near Czechoslovakia. Let's go Montenegro uh, and Bratislava. Okay. I don't know why. Why not? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> but the ch the Chesnia with Albania, I guess. <coughs> Pergroga Mon Moldova. Oh, Jesus, these are hard. Good Lord, this this is You're cruel, cruel, Robin. I was vicious, wasn't I? This, this is awful. brutal. Me and, 
nasty, nasty match cruel. 20 random words to each other. You know what? what you, do. you know what? It would make sense. Maybe if we heard these pronounced correctly, uh, we might have just thought, oh, okay. that's definitely. Here's the, I'm going to run through the pronunciations that I think are correct. And you can tell me if any of them are glaringly wrong. I think it's Bratislava, yeah. Lub Ljubljana, Ljubljana, Zagreb, Tirana, Skopje, Chisnau, <laughs> Sofia, Podgorica, Belgrade, and Sarajevo. I think they would have been a lot better with the music. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can we hear All the right. national anthems, please? Okay, go ahead and call us back. We're not going to get any better, I don't think. We okay, I'm going to go call everybody back. Wow, <laughs> this is tough. That was hard. It worries me that everybody else was done already. My well, they they're, they're, just quick get, they're just quick guessers. Is it's that it? Well, up. you know what? They've all been doing it on the little chart. It's easier when you have it written down and you can match like Deborah did. And the other groups, I've been in the groups already. They're they're all using almost all of them are using Word documents. So yeah. yeah. That that helps a lot. That's what I'm using as an excuse why we took us longer. Okay, I'm going to guess we're going to get two on this one. So anything more than two. two I think right. we're going to get three. I think three? we're going to get closer Let's to five. Let's hear it for four. four. I Let's think we're going to go for five. <laughs> no, I don't think we're going to Two or four, five. that's it. Well, here we go. Closer. All right. All right, All right guys. Good luck. luck. Because I think, you know, for example, um, the, the border between, let's say, Spain and Portugal, Everybody on one side of the, the line speaks Portuguese and everybody on the other side of the line speaks Spanish. And I think to myself, going back to the 1800s, the 1700s and then before, was it like that? Or were there little villages where people spoke different dialects of different things? And um, how did it all get consolidated into everybody on this side speaks Portuguese and everybody on the side speaks Well, they've Spanish. been distinct since about the time still before the... Uh the Islamic Caliphate was uh, thrown out. Portugal was already a distinct section apart from the rest of Spain, what became Spain. We're ready, we're back. I forgot to mention this. I can't believe I'm so off this week. Janine's coming to town. Oh. Janine's coming to town, right, Janine? When? When, when are you coming to town, Janine? That's the plan. Uh, she thinks a she'll week be here from soon. Saturday. Oh, good. Bar barring attack by any three-legged dogs. Barring attack. She'll be here on the sixth. Three-legged dogs. How long Six. are you staying, Janine? Uh, well, I don't. Once I get, once I get to Susan's, I have no itinerary. <laughs> I wanted hope to go to... bird watching with Leonard and with Robin. And but and Leonard's going to be gone. Except I'm going to be up in Oregon. From, yeah, Leonard's going to the 12th of November. be visiting me. And <laughs> when, so, when you won't be there. When I won't the... be there. And I'll visit Leonard while he won't be there. <laughs> and um, I do plan to go up to see Herb and hopefully go to the Exploratorium. Maybe to drive back. I um, could, I could I... be available to go bird watching on the 6th or the 7th. Well, I want to do, I want to like either have a party over here on probably the Sunday. Okay. Unless people want to come over at night, which I don't think anybody wants to, but let's, let's play it by ear, but just giving you the heads up. I forgot all about that, you guys. So keep aware that um, we're, we're going to hopefully do something. So Janine, we, is there a particular bird that you're interested in seeing or just Bigfoot. A condor. Condor. Con so a con <laughs> if, if you want to see a condor, then I think we could do a condor um, excursion to the Pinnacles, mm. possibly. Pterodactyl. If she shows up on Saturday, it'll be Saturday later. Okay. So it's Sunday. Be midday. Well, it depends. I'm taking my mother to Reno. And so the, I will drop her off and head west. Uh, as soon as I can, so Stop, it's drop, just and roll, when Mom. I can get there. <laughs> You're gonna go. Need light. to go a little south too. There, yeah, a lot south. But she's about five hours from Reno, right? Five, six hours. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, That's it's about not horrible. Right. Depending on if there's snow and all that. 
Oh God, if there's snow, I'm sitting and waiting until it's gone. I may not get there till next spring. <laughs> All right, Robin. Well, if, there, if there's snow, you drive south and cut across at LA. Right. And yeah. come up. Oh, or, no. or, or ditch the car and fly. <laughs> Which is what I've been trying to tell her to do is fly. Yeah. But okay. She wants okay, to are we ready? Yeah. 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 <laughs> Bratislava is oh, my just a, a very close to vienna it's just east of vienna it is the capital of slovakia okay and, that one's wrong and Lub ljubljana is the capital of slovenia that one's right okay. zagreb croatia all right uh -huh. zagreb is croatia uh, tirana albania Skopje, North Macedonia. Oh. Chisinau. And if any if, if anybody knows I'm pronouncing these wrongs, feel free to chime in and uh Moldova. <laughs> Washington is the capital <laughs> of Moldova. Chis Chisinau is Moldova. Sofia was probably the easiest one on the list, Bulgaria. Podgorica. Montenegro. Podgorica. Pod How do you say it? Podgorica. 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 Yes. Podgorica. Or Susan would probably say Puerto Rico. <laughs> Puerto Rico is Montenegro. That's a that's actually a good way to memorize it. I need to memorize these. Uh, Puerto Rico, Montenegro. Um, Belgrade, Serbia. Yeah. <laughs> and Sarajevo is Bosnia and Herzegovina. So which one is it, Bosnia or Herzegovina? Or Herzegovina. <laughs> it's they're the same country. So oh, I'm not looking at the list. Yeah. I don't know how we. So do it's it. like Istanbul and Constantinople. Yeah. Istanbul, Istanbul is not Constantinople. Constantinople. Or Byzantium. Nobody else knows that song but me, huh? No, it Maybe was Istanbul, giant. not Constantinople. <laughs> why, why did um, Constantinople get the works? Uh, it's nobody's business but the turbine. Robin, are you pasting the answers in the chat? Oh, you want me to? Yeah, I will. Yeah, I will paste helpful, them yes. in the chat. Yeah. Okay. Uh, hang on one oh, second. Oh, Lord. That was a lot harder. That went by too fast. Okay, that was Let good. Robin, that was terrifying. <laughs> that was a really good thematic we, we had a great team on this one. Really? Yes. Kevin is on the no, team no. with no. Well, Bono, Faith, and Romero. Yeah. It. yeah. And Jamie. Our amount of correct yeah. answers is not super, super high. But. Aspian, did you know all these? I bet you did, huh? Aspian got every one. I was in oh. one of those countries and I didn't even get that one. But we, didn't go, <laughs> we didn't go to that city there. We went to Split, Split Croatia, and that was the only city I remember. Well, I'm from, my family's from Lubricana. Slovenia. Ljubljana. Ljubljana. I, I always pronounce everything with a Spanish accent. So, and I gave like a Washington. Lecture. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I gave a talk. I gave a talk in Sofia, Bulgaria. So I was there. Whoa. That place is just has the best internet in the world. And it is looks like it's something out of um so it's got 6G. Is that what it's got? Yeah, it's it's something out of like a, a, a dystopian. You, what is that? Uh, I always I can't think of <sighs> that movie. What is the movie with the people who are um, uh, alien and um, robots or something? And there's it's always raining in every scene. Blade Runner. Blade Runner. Yeah. Yeah. It, oh, that's a, you should do descriptions of science fiction movies like Carl. <laughs> that, would be, that, that would be around <laughs> science fiction movies by wrong description. <laughs> <laughs> always raining in his robot. Always raining. No, that's a that's a that's an unchanging no by Susan. Caspian and, and, and they're not Caspian. robots. It was it was there raining. No on aliens fans. or robots in Blade Runner. <laughs> <laughs> Other than that, it was exactly correct. <laughs> it was is it and, hey, but we knew what she meant. Yeah, you did. And listen, twenty nineteen does not look like a post-Soviet capital. It looks like if you're walking down the street and you're hanging out with people in Bulgaria, it is just like Blade Runner. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it, it, was, it was raining in nighttime all the time, so they didn't have to build it a bunch of skyscrapers. And it was more like Tokyo-ish. 
Yeah. My my niece went to Hong Sophia Kong, and she maybe. said it was like the a, a wonderful place. It had the best oh. internet. I'm telling you, yeah. it was yeah. fast internet because it's all new. All right, bated breath here. Scores. And the McDonald's. We, 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 we the can McDonald's. come back, team. We, we, oh we only need nine, and no one else can get any. Midnight. <laughs> well, Gary, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, here let's go to the scores. So, Aurora, okay. Bora, Bo, or Robert. Or Boris. Yeah. Yeah, we got a That's ten. Thanks to Caspian. Oh, the ten. I raced him right. You are in the lead. Stop the Stop. count. <laughs> why? Why is it not showing up? What happened? Right there. No, it's not no, it's showing not. up. It's not showing up. It's doing the thing again. No, you don't have thing? that nice book area. We're seeing it. You're just, we're just not seeing the new numbers. Okay, let's try this. Okay, now can there we go. Yeah. yeah, that looks yeah. better. I don't know why, but already. Oops. The Rona. Look at what? that. That's our first game. Robins, Renegades, the Ronas, Trinity, and Fish Heads. That was our first team. <laughs> we played to 100 points. Okay. 100 points. My goodness. What the heck were we thinking? Nobody so, gets what, any points. We win. What the meta with Facebook? Three. Oh, I know. Six. No, we got six. Did you get six? Six. Yeah. Who said three? A liar. Underminer. Okay, here we go. Someone Stop who's not wrestling been. wizards. Ten. Ooh. Ooh. Yay. Oh. Wow. Hey, what's up with sidewalk wrestling wizards? What is it? Leonard. Leonard? And then he got started pulled with the sidewalk and lost. Oh, oh, that makes sense. Okay, now it makes sense. All right. And I had a wizard hat on. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, oh, I thought it was I missed essence. that. I thought it was a Halloween makeup. I missed that. He really did slam his head oh, on no, the he, ground. No, he messed oh, yeah. himself up. Oh, oh. You get Ouch. By after eight. Okay, so what's the matter with Zaka? Two. No, we had six. <laughs> okay. Hey, Kevin. <laughs> Is that Kevin? No, not this time. Oh. Oh. Not this okay. time. But usually okay. it's me. So, so no. it's, it's as long as they get over it's four. It's all down to this. As long as they yeah, get well, over four. We got 10, so. Nice Zero. work. Halloween. Did you get 10? All 10, yeah. Oh, 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 oh my god. That's a pretty good score. That might be one of the highest scores ever. That. that is damn. Damn, 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 damn. 46 well out of 50. Wow. Look at That's that. That's one of the highest ones ever. Anybody had that highest score. I'm glad they good, did good for my round. That is that might be the highest score in the history of I wouldn't doubt it. Let's see. Uh, then again, it might not. I think it is. I don't remember anybody ever getting anything. Has anybody ever gotten a 46 before? But we got a low score in the first round. We can teach you how to do the max function. Yeah, equals now max. Season. Yeah, you can do that. <laughs> what? I don't know. Might be, early on, we used to have the possibility to get more than 10 points in a round. Yeah. No, nobody's ever gotten that high. You guys no, are, nice. are the... Are the they are only the, missed four. Back, back in the bizarre days. There's a 44. Out of 44. Yeah, look at that 42. 42. Yeah, they're 46 out of 50. 43. I think that means they can't be on the same team ever again. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Break them up. Oh, Break you could put up. me anywhere because I only. No, it means they all have to do a category next week. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? I don't have categories yeah. next week. You know, that is really terrific. Look at that. Wow. We should make oh, the winning really team impressive. do categories. The Susan, what's your score? Oh, I would be um, I would Negatives. be six, seven, nine, three, three. Six, 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 six. I predict six. it's going to be an integer. <laughs> okay, we're no longer in last place. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Is hey, last place. You guys did that on purpose. <laughs> Somebody already did no. that. Don't no. Okay, so here's what we got for next week. What am I writing in this little spot here? Someone do their home state, please. Well, then you have already given away. Alan, Alan needs to do a music category. Romero Somebody he'll, Alan. Do, he'll do one. Who? Romero Faith? says he'll do one. Romero or Faith? Romero. I will do a random state if you want. No. R A M E R O. I spell it right. I I I I yes. Miro. Yeah. It's okay. We're used. There's no E. No E. <laughs> Can I add extra R's? 
Yeah. Okay, Romero's doing yeah. cool. Romero? Yeah, he's on the floor with the cat. Yeah. Okay, who else? Here comes Leonard. I think we should volunteer him. <laughs> Walked off. So this Wilma, 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 Wilma. <laughs> Wilma, Wilma. Could do Wilma says no. If you're, if you're stuck, I can do one. Okay, Mono's hey, Mono. Mono. Oh, good. Ooh. Mono will do one. Mono's rules. Want to do a round, Leonard? Monos are hard. I'm not going to be here next week. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm not going to be here either. I don't care who does a round. <laughs> Oh, I, I have like I have ten in the bank. So whenever you Jamie, need somebody, Jamie, Jamie, Did someone say my categories are hard. Somebody said that mm. they're interesting. Uh, I, I thought Aaron, the mono method Aspen, of, of scoring was fantastic. Mike, I love your categories, mm -hmm. Mom. Alan. Categories. Yeah, well, that's a bonus. Randy. That, that's Let's different. see. Then James, Kyle, Mike Wolf. I got a. I got a. I got a. Bonus category, I guess. Okay, bonus, Mike. Okay. Or wait, no, actually, I, I have a regular one. category. Caspian. <laughs> yeah, I have one. a regular category if, if that's easier. Deborah. Oh, I, my week's crazy. I'm gonna have to hold off. Well, Susan doesn't like people doing them two weeks in a row. Yeah. I should be here Thursday. We need, we need part two of Carl's uh, <laughs> category. Yeah, I, got, I got a whole other films. 10 questions left on the mind. Yeah. If you need people, Susan, I'll come up with something. But Part two oh, of the horror I, movies. You did this week, so I'm waiting to see if somebody else is going to come up with something. Karen, I think, was volunteering. I, I can. Oh, Adrian's got one? Yay. I can. I can do one with Greg. Okay. Again. And Caspian would be happy with that, I think. <laughs> mm -hmm. Susan, do you have me as a regular category or a uh, bonus. bonus? Okay. Can I be, do a regular instead? Yeah. I think it's easier for someone else to do a bonus. Somebody else want to, who wants to do the bonus? Adrian, you want to do a bonus? Sure, I can do the bonus. Okay. Uh, there, Mike. Okay, sounds great, y'all. I got it. So Romero, Mono, Caspian, Mike Wolf, and Adrian. Boom. Okay, and I'm gonna put. You put down me and Rob for the following week. I'm gonna put Rob. <laughs> I'm gonna put Kevin. I can go the I'm following week, either regular or bonus. Carl. Okay. Yeah, you gotta stay two weeks ahead. You guys of it, need that to way. stop writing so many categories. It's nice <laughs> that you're doing them, but we gotta push these people to do them. Come on, you guys. Every time I write a category, I go for the tangent, write two other categories at the same time. Yeah, that's, <laughs> I think, that's, I think that's my Rob, problem. Rob is the is the That's most prolific. Rob is number one. The category I did like tonight wasn't the category I started working on. Yeah, you are, Susan, but I'm talking about of the people. Right, and, you are. And we have word, Kevin, that Paul Offit thinks you are the winner. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> winner. He is the well, winner. So what happened to my categories is, I'll, I'll, okay, I got a really good one I did, but I did it weeks ago or months ago. And then some current thing comes up, like this one was Halloween. I just did this yesterday. The week before or the time before, I did John Delancey because I interviewed him. So it's like, I still have this bank of other ones, and then I stick new ones on the front of it. So it's weird. I have a whole bunch here, too, that I have that are just So you can do one for me, Rob. <laughs> yeah. you gotta go. Thank you. Um, I appreciate your it. Your so Halloween, Halloween's coming. My up, category guys. is categories Wilma isn't good at. <laughs> oh. Oh. Anything requiring okay. you to watch television but, shows or seen movies when you were a kid. But mm -hmm. Carl, that would only be like one or two. You need ten. Yeah. Mm. Good. Good one, Karen. Nice mm. save. All right, y'all. It was good seeing you. Sign up for Skeptical. I'm not kidding. It was a really good. Happy Halloween. It was. Happy Halloween, y'all. Have a good time. We'll have a quiz on what happened on Skeppardy. That's what we should do a category on what happened in Skeppardy. Hi, booze and ghouls. Boo!